the freestyle <laughs> by Corey Holcomb and this bitch. <laughs> Cause I don't like your daughter, bitch. <laughs> I don't like your daughter, bitch. Ever since I saw the little hoe, niggas knocking on my motherfucking door. <laughs> Is Trina there? <laughs> Is she coming out? I say, hey, put that thing in that bitch mouth. I don't like your daughter, bitch. <laughs> Going in my refrigerator. Every nigga that nut in her. Somehow they hate her. Oh. Her two kids that she kept because she thought them dudes was going to give a fuck. <laughs> but then they ducked out on her ass. <laughs> fuck that silly slut. Even though that bitch do got a big ass butt. But I ain't fuck her though. Because it's your daughter. So get the daughter. All right. Corona Tuesdays in this bitch. We made it another week. We finna talk this shit. I am Corey Holcomb. This is Darlene OG Ortiz. Hey. Craig Fax in this bitch. And we have a female comic <laughs> from LA. Am I hey, right? Yes, LA. Yeah. Neighborhood. Camille, Camille White. <laughs> yes, Camille White. God damn it. Introduce a Camille White. You know they talk shit. I don't give a fuck. That's what's up. <laughs> they said, no, praise they God. They know me up in there. They know me. That's what's up. I love it. <laughs> we got motherfucking. Look, I want to talk about Kamira just for a second. Praise I saw her God. perform one time in life, and I never forgot it, because she one of them female comics that don't be talking about all dick pussy shit, you know what I'm saying? Like, I ain't trying to knock female comics, but a lot of female comics ain't really got no jokes to me. But I saw you perform one time, never forgot you. That's right. Never forgot you, and I'm glad we finally hooked it up. Were you here? Right. I'm I'm happy to be here, man. You know I love you. That's what's up. <laughs> Respect. Respect. Uh, and also, when I was, look, before, I don't even know, I wanted to tell you this. Before I even figured out your name, because I couldn't remember your name, I was asking Craig, because I've been looking for a female comic to be on the road for me, roll with me. Yeah. And I'm just saying, uh, at first, Craig brought up somebody. I forgot who that was. But then he said, well, it's this one girl named Kamira White. I was like, that's her. <laughs> I knew that was who he was. I was like, that's the one. So Craig thinks highly of you. Um, and um, I'm just saying, it's like, I want to hook it up in the future where we do some road work. No, we, that's what's so up. So motherfuckers can see what's too. up. Motherfuckers can see some a funny female comic. Real that's right. Motherfucking a sleeper. <laughs> sleeper meaning motherfuckers y'all might not all know yet. You know what I'm saying? But them sleepers be a motherfucker. Especially if I got them with me, they're going to be funny because I can't. Be a monster. Right. You know what I'm saying? I'm try I'm just trying to give you all your proper Oh, thank you. I appreciate it. You know what I'm saying? I appreciate it. Uh, and Craig is, a, yeah, I, thank you, Craig. Oh, so Sticking good. up for a real bitch. The short, <laughs> the, the short time that I've known her already, I was like, oh, this is Carithia. <laughs> <laughs> Darlene feel like she act like me or, yep. or, or you know what I'm saying. This is she, the people, yeah. But she keep it real. Keep it, I'm telling you, yeah. the, them the motherfuckers I like, motherfuckers who ain't scared to say what it is. Mm. I am a work in progress and I'm proud of that shit. I am not an angry bitty. <laughs> <laughs> That's what they Comic say. Comic huh? as yeah. has been put out there on the net by the fruit mm. booty side of the game, folks. <laughs> uh, but uh, oh, these niggas in the chat rooms is ain't going what in. They getting you? <laughs> what they no, say? No, they love me. You oh, see, yeah, Camira, no. welcome to the G spot. Niggas love me. Camira got them oh, big old you, titties. Hey, oh, they're yeah. gonna hit you up in your inner DMs. Her DMs gonna be full. That's why I wear my jacket down. I know how to get them. Nigga. I and everything I say is funny. <laughs> Do the whole show topless, fuck it. Right. <laughs> Here go Craig. Here go Craig. You still got youth in you because yeah. your titties still stick up. Yeah, they and stand I buy up. good bras. These motherfuckers are hundred dollars. Oh, you oh bought a real bra? Oh yeah, bitches. Yeah. yeah, I gotta order my shit from Space, nigga. I can't even get my shit in the store. <laughs> nigga, my shit's so fun. My shit's so big, nigga. Uh, I gotta order them. They don't carry this size in the store. But do you know what's funny? Have you ever took a broke bitch to buy a real bra? She don't even believe it. <laughs> <laughs> When they say the price, she be like, shit, I ain't paying all that for that. Yeah, Teddy Care is expensive, man. Real they know all my business. This nigga said tire slayer, because you know I slash nigga tires when they hurt my feelings. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. We got You break my heart, I break your shit, nigga. Because niggas don't care about that crying shit. Nigga, you got to break a stereo or something. You got to make them cry, nigga. Some rims. You cut a nigga tire, they going to cry. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Especially if he got some motherfucking real tires. Uh, yeah. Yeah. Mm. Real tires cost money. Yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, and you got to do more than one, ladies, because if you just do one, he could just roll on the donut for a minute. Might not be <laughs> you got to hurt him. Yeah. You got to do three. You got to do three. That's Leave some one. Bullshit. Leave one. Leave one. Be like, nigga, I love you. I could have did four. Leave one because you might take him back. <laughs> Leave one. <laughs> That's some bullshit. Praise Leave God. <laughs> praise God. That's some bullshit, man. Praise God. You know what? It is. Don't praise bring God. God in that. Don't it's bullshit, it. Lord. You know it's Don't bullshit. Talking to you, God. I know crazy girls when I deal with them, then I ain't gonna even lie. I be I know I done fucked up. When I'm leaving their house, it's a feeling of you not getting away. <laughs> <laughs> it's just a feeling like you ain't just got that pussy in that's it. Hell no. Nah. Watch that movie Fatal Attraction. What the well nah. girls I'm not gonna be ignored. Right. And she was like, like Ooh, oh, she was shit. scared. Yeah. I done <laughs> fucked up. How about <laughs> it cost to walk away? <laughs> Do you remember watching the movies younger, Darlene, and being like, that bitch crazy? Hey, oh, for and real. And then when you got older, you'd be like, I understand oh, that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. that's <laughs> fucked up. That's, that's oh, fucked shit. Up. Yeah. See where that came from. <laughs> ain't no excuse you'd be like, for crazy. I understand. You know your girl crazy when y'all fall asleep and you go downstairs and hide all the knives. You know what I'm saying? Oh, have, you, that's, hey, yeah, Greg, that's crazy have you ever thing. woke up, like just moved and then look and she's looking right at you? Of course. You sleep? Of course. Right. But of not course. in a cute way. Like, look at mommy. Like, I got in an argument with this girl. We was at this hotel and she was up before me. Walking around in the other, I was like, what the fuck is you doing up? <laughs> I don't fuck with you like that. I'm hey. wilding in here. Ah, uh, that's in right. <laughs> walking around, cause he's, <laughs> I was, that's what you all scared of? Yeah, what, yeah. Was, what was so scary about that? Karma. Karma. Oh my god. <laughs> that hey, motherfucker. She's trying to hurt you while you still laying down. Yeah, that's hilarious. How hilarious. else they gonna get you? She ain't gonna get mm. me when I'm standing up. They no. always get me with them down. Oh, in the hey. back. The sneaky. <laughs> Slice the tire a, shit. A bat That's behind true. the knees will buckle you up. Record all your texts and show them to other people. Yeah. Oh, that's sweet. that's why you got to sleep with gloves on in case you got to choke her out when you oh, wake up. Oh. Ain't no fingerprints. <laughs> oh my god, that's what you the pillowcase. Hey. You a damn fool. That's what the pillowcase is for. You can't Craig. sleep Goodness. in my bed with no fucking gloves. <laughs> <laughs> Women like that when they with a nigga and they know they like one wrong thing from my ass whooping. That make everything better. The sex, the discipline, everything is better that way. Oh yeah, well. Yeah. Well, yeah. I'm not gonna lie. I do need to be scared of you a little bit because I'm be. a bitch your ass. I do need to be scared of you a little bit. But look, like, I know what you're saying is coming from the heart. No, for real. That ain't that ain't just a joke, <laughs> is it? <laughs> no, I have to be scared of you a little because niggas always come with that bullshit. So if I'm not scared of you, nigga, we'll be fighting for real. Like if you, I fight niggas my height. No, if, I fuck around and win. <laughs> <laughs> if you ain't scared of the motherfucker, that means you even bolder with the yeah. shit you That's gonna what I'm do. Saying. Yeah. Like, I, I know motherfucker. Look, yeah. I, I I know it's some women out here who crazy as fuck. My homeboy from the crib, this motherfucker was motherfucking killer. You know what I'm saying? We all know killers. This motherfucker went to the club one night with his wife. Now he normally be in there with his bitch he fuck with. Right. Oh, that motherfucker that? went with his wife. Mm. And that bitch ran up on him. And everybody was like, bitch, is you crazy? <laughs> Do you know who the fuck that is? That bitch said, I don't give up. <laughs> right. Oh. right, right, right. I was like, bitches, it's crazy out here. This yeah. bitch just ran up on a nigga. All he got to do is dip. That bitch be missing. Uh, what what she, happened? We ain't got to talk about all that. Oh, yeah. All I know is <laughs> that, <laughs> that bitch ran up on him while he was out with his wife. And yeah, everybody know, who, bitch, you know who you, the, the, the niggas who grab bitch, do you know who you fucking <laughs> with? That uh, bitch didn't uh, care. Uh, uh, That's uh, what I knew uh, women was crazy. Uh, I was like, okay. And when yeah. they, mm, it's mm, crazy mm, bitch down here. You can't do that if a nigga really, really love his wife. No. <laughs> no. If they on the fence, you could do that. But if he really love his bitch, don't no. do that, bitch. Mm -hmm. no. nigga. Now, see, we learning shit about her. You got respect <laughs> for a nigga wife. Hell yeah, nigga. Niggas love their wife. They, that nigga got down on his knees and proposed to her. Will you he tell don't matter these... if he fucking you. He love that bitch. I've seen right. it. See? Tell these crazy bitches. <laughs> tell these crazy bitches this protocol to this shit. You can't run up on the number one. No, no. you can't. That's gonna get your ass. I can see beat. if I'm in here with a foreign bitch. I'll right. be like, baby. Like, you can't cheat on me with yeah. Right. yeah. Bitch, I'm look. the only bitch you supposed to be cheating with. Uh, yeah, the Uber brothers here. Yeah. I'll, right. I'll run up on the side, bitch. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna respect your wife. You know. Hey, That's yeah. real motherfucking shit. Yeah. God damn it. That's Respect the wife. Straight up. I'm stuck with her. <laughs> you ever had them arguments with your side bitch about your wife? Them is some of the most greatest arguments that never hit TV. I'm sick of the bitch too. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Fuck I'ma do. <laughs> Can't just make the bitch disappear. <laughs> <laughs>
This ain't the 50s and 60s when what? you can just leave. She got papers on me. Right. Oh, that's yeah, funny. You can just leave. But, but look, I'm talking about some real shit now. With this corona shit and motherfuckers having to stay in the house, all over the country, bitches is getting their ass what? Oh, yeah. That nigga day five in there with that bitch, that nigga done stomped that bitch out. Yeah, they sleeping with boxing gloves on now. And the police ain't taking niggas to jail like they was, because the jail, they don't want them sick niggas in jail. So now bitches calling, he jumped on me. The police like, well, bitch, be quiet while you in jail. <laughs> oh, my God. And oh if you got God. a gang of small kids, oh, my God. Because I see the little kids in the neighborhood driving their parents crazy already. Yeah. Just, hmm. just frustrated. Everybody's frustrated. Teenagers, too. Oof. Eating people out of house and home, just getting oh, on everybody's yeah, nerves. Yeah. You got a lot and they're of kids. dirty too. They still don't. It's want hard to, to be at home yeah. with your family. <laughs> <laughs> Some I don't know. real shit, nigga. <laughs> I'm good. I'm by myself. You I just drop off the a bitch kid. Uh-huh. And the kids she kept. They normally it's your your real son <laughs> and two older kids that and, would and came you're with. And you never home now, so now step up, nigga. Mm-hmm. They telling you real to step respect. up, nigga. Go play with the kids. You never home. This your opportunity. Right. The step kids trying to talk to you and shit. You like, I don't fuck with y'all. Yeah, like now that now that now the yeah. kids see what he's about too. Yeah. yeah. If it's a stepdad or a stepmom. See what they mama about too. Or their stepmom too, you're right. That yeah. never, being together can destroy a family. Yeah, mm-hmm. that's real shit. Hardest thing about being home is telling the truth. You got to tell It's them. a lot of side bitches sad right now too though. Mm-hmm. They got like, empty- So you're not gonna come over the whole time? Yeah, yeah, you can. <laughs> <laughs> and them right. bitch, that, this is what I'm worried about. Yeah. Them bitches might be sick. Yeah, yeah. No. Have you ever thought about that? Because they, they got saying. to do something while you gone. Yeah. Right. That's, that's, what, that's what all the doctors were just saying. They were saying, oh, I hope to goodness that all these people that are having affairs, marital affairs, are not going out playing around right now. Just wait till the shit's over. Yeah. I ain't going to lie. I went to this bitch's house. Oh, yeah. see, here we go. Look, and this bitch see. always talk about it's all about me and all this shit. I hate when they do that. Because when I went to her bathroom, oh. it was some real... Yellow ass pee on the stool. Nigga, I don't know why bitches I'm don't like, clean their over here. I'm like, who be over here? Nigga, who my brother know? told me that all it's, niggas look in your bathroom, lift your toilet up and everything, because if it's pee on your toilet, that's, a that's how they know it's other niggas at right. your house, yeah. bitch. This bitch clean fucking a nigga toilet. on vitamins. Oh my god, <laughs> that <laughs> pee was that oh, pee was yeah. yellow than yeah. a motherfucker. Yeah. I was gonna say medication, yeah. right? I was gonna say you could tell when they're on medication. Like on, yeah. yeah, I'm like, who the fuck <laughs> been over here? I didn't say nothing to her though. The Viagra and everything, yeah, you know. I never say nothing. I don't yeah. like to bust you out. I don't care what you do. The Ugh. pussy can't get corona though, so you just don't kiss her. What you oh mean the pussy Lord. can't get corona? Oh, they stop. got a new vitamin it's C droplets. condom, nigga. It's just air. Oh no. What do you say? They got a new a vitamin C condom. Steel? This nigga said they got a vitamin C condom. <laughs> they do. It's oh. dipped in citrus. It got vitamin C all so over. So what? The rest of you is gonna be covered like hazmat. You don't need to kiss a bitch to fuck her. You know what? You don't need to kiss a bitch to fuck her. In fact, it's not common amongst real players. But right. some of these yeah. bitches you like. This <laughs> you be like, I ain't gonna lie, I got my wife and I don't yeah. wanna leave her, but some of yeah. these bitches, you be fucking these bitches, you be like, damn, I like her. I only fuck I bitches. I wish I could have all three of them. <laughs> <laughs> I only fuck bitches that's cool with me thumb wrestling them before I fuck. I don't want oh, no intimacy. You know what I'm saying? I just want all it? fun and games. I know. Yeah. Yeah. We went into the wing shop, right? Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah, do it. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> all okay, girls yeah, don't yeah. recognize that. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. All girls don't recognize that. <laughs> that let me, I'm learning about you today. <laughs> I'm sitting there watching your ass. Like. She a monster, man. She one of them ones. <laughs> oh, my God. My she fucking know you got one. a bitch just because you be around there. You wanted to test it? That's right. But I have. This nigga got my nose for it. I have great excuses no matter what the fuck. That's why I don't fuck with Virgo niggas. I, <laughs> look, I didn't try. We Virgos? connect. Yes, you lie. You see, they lie good yeah. with a straight face. Yeah. I'm a Virgo? Like, yes, you a Virgo. Nigga, I know your sign, nigga. What, what is my that? birthday? You September something, nigga. Fuck that. I, I know. No. That's that internet oh, birthday yeah, them niggas June. put up there. He's oh, so you're not a Virgo? No, niggas be June. calling me around that time like, happy birthday, nigga. <laughs> oh, my God. I just right. knew you were a Virgo. Hey, hold on, though. So wait, 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 what's your sign? I don't jealous. never take it down either. I'll be like, leave it up there. I don't give a fuck. What yeah. the fuck is your sign? Because I thought I had you figured out, nigga. I'm not 
Tell me. Oh, <laughs> oh, we know what it is. Oh, well, no, I'm an not. Aries. They canceling my birthday. Yeah, my that's birthday fake April seventh. Aries, you like my mama and shit. Do you be doing this when you get mad? Oh. I do a lot of shit when I get mad. <laughs> that's that He's TV dumb. look. <laughs> but I really talk a lot. I let a lot of shit slide. Corey's out, a cancer. It, yeah, June twenty third. June twenty third. That makes sense too. Nah, oh. I see. Everything makes sense. No, That's why I'm fucking Zodiac sign. Cancers talk a lot of shit. 50 Cent is a cancer. Like, cancers talk a lot of shit. I'm but Aquarius. Virgos do too. What, is, what do Aquariuses do? Oh, Ooh. you cold. That's why you don't got no bitch. Oh, I got you several know. bitches. I know, exactly. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> Aquariuses want to party till they, to the, to the grave, nigga. For real? Right. That's what we on? Okay. Do you party? Smart. I, I don't party, but I can see what she means, though. I'm goofy, so that's yeah. my form of partying. Yeah. Man, don't none of that Zodiac shit mean shit, it God do. damn it. It do. I didn't fuck um, Gemini bitches that eat ass, and I heard they don't Wait, eat ass. What? Oh, my God. <laughs> Gemini bitches are freaks, though. My daughter is Gemini. I be sad. <laughs> hey, you better watch her. <laughs> How old is your daughter? She 18. I was a teen parent. <laughs> yeah, I don't got no kids in my house. I'm an empty nester. What's up? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> your, your daughter, your your daughter grew up under you. What? Yeah, I raised her. Well, that, I, don't, that ain't common. Grandma. I uh -huh. raised her, but we yeah. was at my mama's house. But my, I took the. <laughs> when I was there, I took so the your mama raised y'all. <laughs> <laughs> Shit, I ain't dropping no names, but I want to tell you something. Do you remember we was at the improv? Uh -huh. Man, do you know when I spoke to you that night? Now, I, I, I hadn't seen you, had I? Right. I, don't, I didn't even know you. Right. I was telling you how talented I thought you, you were. You did, he did. Do you know these bitches was calling my phone, acting like all kind of shit? No, they be mad. They be hella mad. At me, me and, and Precious, they mad. They that's, what, that's what I want to talk about. Jealousy. Oh man. Jealousy is worse than the corona shit. It is. <laughs> yeah, hell yeah. Jealousy. Do you know how many people fall out over jealousy? Man. And if you nice, if you a type of person who try to be nice, mm. you're gonna get played every time. And I'm not talking about played by people in the streets. It be bitches out here jealous of their kids. That's some uh, real shit. It be uh, sisters I've jealous that, yeah. of each other. It be mm -hmm. niggas jealous of each other. And it mm -hmm. goes unchecked. Nobody, there is no class in college or anything mm. that prepares you for jealousy. Right. So most yeah. people handle that shit violently or they punk out. They right. be like, well, that's my so-and-so, so I'm gonna let them do that shit. No, mm. let me tell you something about jealousy. You better check that shit if they're around you. Right. Somebody jealous of you, you don't know. I don't mm. give a fuck. Mm -hmm. But mm -hmm. I don't care who it is. If you around me and I pick up on that jealousy trait, mm. I'm going to check it. And tell you, you can, I don't give a fuck what you talking about. Go get it over with. If we gonna yeah. fight and argue, let's fight and argue now. Right. But I'm talking about with kin folks. Kin folks be jealous of you. I'm talking about it be your brother. Oh, so yeah. you you'll give it a pass forever. Yeah. Yeah. Right. yeah. Forever, meaning as long as mm -hmm. you alive. You'll just right. let it go. Yeah. But as I've gotten older, I realize, man, when you around motherfuckers who jealous of you, right, right. you have to check them and let them know that shit don't bother me. Yeah. Right. That's a that's but a delicate that's you're a losing. delicate balance though. Mm -hmm. What? Because you can't really confront all of it because it'll yes, weaken you it'll weaken you though. No, you mm -hmm. weak for not confronting it. So every And that ain't no diss. Right, okay. It be motherfuckers who don't check their mama, and they mama be motherfucking acting crazy with somebody like that's close to you. Right. Like it might even be your wife. And your mama don't like your wife. Mm -hmm. What are you supposed to do? Just let your mama run, act, act like she want to act? Hell no. Because no. then you're not protecting your woman. That's what I'm saying. And yeah. vice versa. If right. your woman acting funny with a family member or whatever, whatever, mm -hmm. you're supposed to check that shit. Right. Because right. I know right from wrong. Right. And I tell you, right. you out of pocket. Okay. Yeah. You out of pocket. And you making it hard for me because I like let's say if it's your mother I'm gonna love you no matter what right but, but you're not gonna get mm -hmm. away with that shit around me right, right. check right. that shit and tell you you wrong and if you run me away from you what right. the fuck could I do so let me so it's different when you're checking men as opposed to women right no nah. 
You don't think so? Because mm-hmm. I don't have as much patience with niggas when I sense that type of weakness. Right. If a nigga get out of pocket her. with me and I'm yeah. and I'm coming out of love, so you like, let the woman I don't get really away with pre- it more. Then I, huh? You let a, you'll let a woman get away with it longer. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Normal. yeah. It's normal. Nah, nah I won't. Let, I, I won't let a woman get away with it. But if sometimes I feel like people don't know uh, enough of the picture to have a, a, an but opinion. But see, Craig is talking from the standpoint of a six-two, big motherfucker. Craig ain't little. So motherfuckers, look, niggas kill each other. Niggas don't mm. play with each other mm. like right, that. Right, right. Cause right. niggas know. Mm. Niggas be like, what? Yeah. And it turned into a fight. Right, right. Or somebody get beat up. Mm-hmm. But I'm saying like, you will let a woman punk you before you let a man punk you, but it ain't nothing to be embarrassed about because right. you naturally had that thing unless you a bully or a crazy nigga. Nah, I ain't a bully at you all. You kind of fold, you be yeah, like, It's just oh, a bitch, just a woman. Don't be yeah. like that. Yeah. Right, right. right. You don't mm-hmm. never really check that shit for real. And I just be feeling like they understand and has to be up to par. If I feel like they can't discern or decipher the information I'm giving, then sometimes it feel like a waste of time. Because if, if you around me and I fuck with you, that means I got love for you. So everything that I would do, is out of love. So if, I, if it's certain shit where if I feel like I got to bring it up, I just feel like you're not even on my level to where you even deserve. But you wouldn't be around that. no yeah, nigga so that act jealous that. of you, Craig. Right. Right. I was just going to say and, that. And I'm saying, I'm saying this because I watch the niggas you be around. Nigga, you be around niggas who just as big as you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> and I swear I'm not making this shit up. Mm. Nigga, you remember we was at the fight? Yeah, yeah. Nigga, all them niggas seem like they was level-headed niggas. All day long, hell yeah. I can't be with motherfuckers. I had a homie out here, and he was jealous hearted. And I didn't even know how to deal with it, because I had never seen a man not be able to control his Please. jealousy. It's right, a lot, right, it's right. It's a lot of what I learned yeah. about this comedy game. It's kind of like, because we like in the arts and shit. Like, it's not a lot of real niggas in a comedy game. A lot of niggas went to theater school and shit right. like that. <laughs> you know what yeah. I'm saying? And they different. Right. Like, they dress like niggas like y'all, but when you talk to them, they, them not nah, niggas. They you know not, what I'm saying? Nah. Not the niggas that I'm used to. Nah. You know what I'm saying? They quit. They weird. You know what I'm saying? And when you say the niggas you used to, what you mean? I mean, I was raised around real niggas. I mean, I was raised around alpha males, niggas that are men. You know it what I'm saying? It shows. Yeah. And I, 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 I'm telling you, I don't know you as good as I want to get to know you. <laughs> and I ain't meaning that in no flirtatious way. Yeah. I'm just saying, you seem like the type of woman who can hang with niggas and the bullshit All won't day. be happening. She the type of woman where you know if you fight her and she connects, she could probably kneel you. You ever, been, <laughs> you ever <laughs> have a bitch hit, hit you and you go to you the oh, you, you, you gotta wake up and really whoop her ass. Like, <laughs> well, that's, what that. she, that's what she was saying on stage yeah, to I have me yeah, laughing. Yeah. She about, a real one. If you need me to whoop a bitch ass. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I'm yeah. laughing. Cause I, I had never heard no comedy like that, but I loved it. But I was always that homegirl niggas would call like, ooh, come slap the shit out of my baby mama. She ain't let me see my son. I'll be like, oh my God, again. Uh, <laughs> again. <laughs> <laughs> Hey, that again. shit funny than a motherfucker. <laughs> you gotta have a bit about. You got a bit about that? I used to talk about it, but I, oh. you know, you be moving on in comedy, and you don't be going back to that shit. But oh, yeah, mm-hmm. yeah I really been talking about um, my family, and I'm trying to make comedy more personal because there's a lot of motherfuckers that steal from you, yep. so they'll remix your shit. Right. And I'm just tired of that. Like I feel like when I started talking about I hated my daughter and I hate my kids and I hate to be in the mom, then all these bitches started hating their kids. So now I don't mm-hmm. even wanna talk about that shit mm-hmm. no more. You know, you know it, was, it was years of me doing comedy before I started meeting people who were successful that I felt like were, that were similar to me. Now, Corey, you was the first nigga that I met where I was like, okay, th- this is a motherfucker that is cut, I'm, we cut from the same cloth. It took yeah. years, nigga. For you to realize that? To meet because, motherfuckers oh, in comedy who was like cut right. from the same cloth. Mm-hmm. Well, what you mean when you say that? Because I, 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 I want to I know what well, you Craig mean. Well, Craig had his own style. I didn't mean to interrupt, oh, but that's you. how you had your, you, both of y'all have your own style. Right. And it took Craig a minute to get in. I knew Craig was talented, but his own style was so different. Niggas didn't respond to it, but then right. when he got on that roast me nigga, and yeah. you really, it really made you shine. Like, yeah, you know what thank I'm you. It was like so, a workout for what I, you do. I'm the yeah. nigga of all niggas, and white people was fucking with my shit heavy in super hood rooms, but I had trouble when I started with the whole politics, you know what I'm saying? Because, um, you know, I was already a man when I started comedy. I wasn't a boy, mm-hmm. and I wasn't starving. How old was you? I was 28. 
and I had a whole rap career. Five albums, had record deals and all that shit. So I that was shit in, went triple plastic. It, it went plastic. Yeah. 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 I, I sold records though out the trunk. That's, but, so That's the way to do it though too. Bro. But what I'm saying was I, I had experience and when I, when I stepped into comedy, you know what I'm saying? I told myself I was going to give myself 10 years to, de to move, dedicate though, yeah. to my artistry. Just mm -hmm. getting better as a comedian, learning the craft because I already, already had an advantage when it came to telling a story and knowing myself, you know what I'm saying? But my struggle was just with just the whole artistry. So that took like, that took like 10 years. I started comedy in uh, 09 mm -hmm. after the stock market crash and I lost everything. You know what I'm saying? So this wasn't something that I always wanted to do, but I was always the funniest nigga I knew, but c comedy wasn't my career. I didn't see that right. as no career. I didn't know no comedians. Right. I right. knew, you know what I'm saying? I knew regular working motherfuckers and dope dealing hood niggas, but I didn't really know no mm -hmm. niggas in entertainment. So. My first like five years was a struggle because I thought everybody was a fag. I'm like, these niggas is all gay, nigga. Like, but this. that's what happened yeah. to me when I moved out here and I really realized that mostly everybody, the niggas was fucking the niggas. It just blew my mind. Like, I actually went home and sat down and I said, I ain't gonna never make it. Yeah, is that for me? I don't even no. fit in in this shit. No, man. This is all gay niggas. But motherfuckers think it's just comedians. It's everybody who made it. Out of everybody who made it, it's probably about 15% niggas that don't fuck niggas. Yeah. And that's in all industries of entertainment. Yeah. This shit weird. Now, man. that's it fucked is. up to say, but it's the truth. When you be around niggas and you really see what's up with them, you mm -hmm. be like, oh, shit, it's this is a shot caller. Yeah. He ain't going to fuck with me. No. He can't even be around me because yeah. I know he don't want to be who he is around me. Right, right. Even though he like me. Right. I'm talking about like my talent. They just can't fuck with me. Right. And, it was and, niggas I looked up to, like, you know, coming in the game. And then I met him and I was like, yeah, ugh. Change your, yeah. <laughs> like, you niggas didn't make me, like, you don't even know I have great respect for you when I first met uh, you. Uh, <laughs> I held you to a standard. You now were going you, off of a character. Now I won't even answer your phone call if you right. call my phone, bitch ass nigga. Like, this is. I'm telling you, it's a gang of niggas like that. I don't, I don't fuck Damn. with Damn. Damn. Mm -hmm. and, and like you said, like we ain't even got a name drop. When we came in here, when you came in here, we was talking about certain shit. Like, you don't get along with certain motherfuckers and it all be the same motherfuckers. Want me to tell you why? Because there are people out here who have a low tolerance for that fake shit and you get mistaken as angry, bitter mm -hmm. comics. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but really, them the angry, bitter motherfuckers. Them the motherfuckers who hate the world. <laughs> You just be checking their ass. You be like, man, get your faggot ass the fuck out of my face, bitch yeah. ass nigga. Right. That's some real shit. Mm -hmm. Everything mean, Corey say is pretty much true. I don't know, no, because I, I don't know everything you say, nigga. But. And I could say this: <laughs> if you gay, I don't hate you. I, in fact, I could even at this stage in my life, I can respect gay niggas, but I can't. Fuck with you up close, meaning like you can't be in my crib. I thought it was you more. Can't, you can't. You can't. You can't just be up under me. I didn't think it was just that. I thought it was more of the 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 hiding behind it. Remember when you said? Because I, I asked you one time. I, I think you said something about the. Because you, how many people? An uh, openly gay him? man. I can hang with him. He right. can come there to my crib. Yeah. Right. That's what uh, I'm saying. Right. Openly gay man. Right. Right. Because right. it ain't no cap. Yeah. Right. But you can't right. be walking around here. Yeah. What's up, man? Yeah. I'm like. Oh, mm -hmm. uh, no. Nah, nah, hell no, man. Hell no. Nah. Yeah. I'm going to have flame on the show one day, man. Mm -hmm. I should have been had flame yeah. on the show so we can have this talk because I want everybody to see me talk to a motherfucker who ain't scared of who he is. Right, right. right. Flame business, motherfucker, man. Right. That yeah. motherfucker used to be right. performing in the room in Chicago with wild ass gangster niggas, but at the wild. They yeah. respected Flame because they was like, okay, this nigga. He, he out with it. He, he's out and, with it. And Flame been a beast for, for a long time. Like, you know, her, her you know, uh, her shit that's coming, she been, should have got them accolades. She been mm -hmm. a. That nigga get mad at me because he be time. trying to get me to call up, call him or her. I be like, nigga, if you don't get your oh, motherfucking ass, fuck it. That's what's going to be funny when we <laughs> on the show. Cause yeah. I, man, Flame was on stage. It was some couple heckling him. And I don't give a fuck how hard gangster you was. He had the whole room laughing because he was, you know how he talking. He said, he said oh, bitch, shut up because I'll beat your ass. And then he looked at the dude. She was with us. She was like, nigga, I'll beat right, your motherfucking right, right, ass. Right, right, right. All right. right. <laughs> nigga was on the floor. Mm -hmm. nigga, that's the club where everybody got killed. E2s in Chicago used to be the clique. 
We used to perform in that motherfucker, and you could hear the music upstairs while you dancing, so it was hard to do comedy in there. Oh, right, wow. right. And Flame was one of the motherfuckers that could be on stage and hold mm-hmm. his own. That shit ain't easy. Yeah, I, we, we had gladiator rooms in Chicago. <laughs> I'm sure they got them out here, too, even though Hollywood is a little easier with the clubs. But I'm saying, like, they got. I went to some room out here. I think it was called uh, the the something room, the, the family room, the family room, yeah. hood yeah. shit. Oh yeah, that's some hood shit. Hood shit. Oh yeah. I love that shit. I rock yeah. that motherfucker. Mm-hmm. You know, that was what I. That was like years ago. Yeah, that was my spot. Yeah. Bring Sometimes I wonder, am I too far removed from the people to do shit like that, or yeah. do people look at me like? I'm, no, no, you still mm. got hood love. For okay, sure. good. I, I, I still got hood. it. Niggas love me. The hood to tell yeah. you though. Yeah, the hood of yeah, Terry. What, what am I talking about? I went to New York yeah. and I did the room, Rob Stapleton room, and um, it was a reminder that I could still pull it off. Rob Stapleton got a room. I can't believe I forgot the name of the room. Some salsa Look. something in, in New, York. New York. This hood shit. Right. Nigga, I scared him for a second, though. Is but after a while, I had him. Hey. At first, they was like, <laughs> did he say that? <laughs> 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 Salsa Dale something shit. I don't know the name of the room, uh, but it was packed out. Uh, I'm loving that shit. Wait a minute. Someone got no, one of Corey no, Long T so short. Flame, Flame got on one of Corey Long T. Fuck y'all niggas. <laughs> they said Craig ain't social distancing. Yeah, salsa con fuego. <laughs> we ain't got shit. <laughs> <laughs> I know, look, he's look, on the free up in this motherfucker. Oh, that's funny. So, no, you notice he's pushing away from Corey. Or Corey's uh, pushing no, away I from Corey. Oh, no, I'm good. I'm just messing with What they say? What they say? They said Craig ain't social distancing. <laughs> yeah. hey, you, I don't give a fuck about Corona. <laughs> no, but let me tell you, this nigga Corey going to text me like, you feeling all right? You coughing and shit? I'm like, nigga, I'm oh, good. Yeah. Nigga, where, yeah, the, I'm good. where the address at? <laughs> oh, no, but look, that's why... <laughs> You don't know how glad I am we broke the ice because I'm scared of new niggas. You I know, know what I'm I saying? know, me too, I know. And yeah. I know you understand what I mean yeah, when I yeah, say that. Yeah. But I'm glad we broke the ice. Yeah, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Shit, I'm glad you're here. I fucks with you. That's good. At the end, you talk. Because I ain't never heard you talk other than that day on stage, <laughs> which probably was goddamn eight years ago. Yo, yeah, that was a while ago. That long? It was a while ago. I saw him perform. He me early in my career. It was a while ago. I was ago. like, who the fuck is this? Because yeah. when I go up to that, when I used to go up to the J spot, oh my God, that is a fucking zoo. They pray on the week up but there. But that's why I, I love, love that doing room. nigga rooms. Because if you if you a beast in a, in an all black room, they don't I give a fuck. Room. Like you could do comedy anywhere. Mm-hmm. You know I agree. I know a comic got followed to the car by another comic, and when she ain't give him the number, he was trying to fight her. <laughs> really? What? That type of shit happened up there at that motherfucking oh, club. Oh my god. Yeah, I mean niggas be Y'all bad. know what the fuck I'm talking about. Yeah. Yeah, I know exactly. Every time I tell a nigga I don't want his number, he be like, fat bitch. I'm right. like, but you just like me. This is just aspirin, you know. Yeah. Fuck you then, you fat bitch. I'm like, okay, whatever. It's good. Yeah. That's how it goes. Mm-hmm. That's the real <laughs> shit. That shit funny. Yeah, it is kinda it is kinda um, mentally devastating when you flirt with a girl who you be like, I know you ain't tripper. That's I've done that before. Yeah, I have yeah, been yeah. rejected by girls. I'm like, are you serious? You ain't <laughs> fucking with me? Now that's hilarious. That's kind of that's pretty funny though. What? Like she said, you actually are trying to holler at somebody, and then when they they say no, nah. well, see, I do it. I do it as kindly as I can because I don't want the person to feel bad. I go, oh, thank you so much. I'm flattered, but bad timing. You just uh, take the L, or do you, well, you, do but, you go down but fighting? Like how she I was said, shocked this one girl would not fuck with me. I even took my hat off. I got hair, <laughs> bitch. Oh, oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> you ordered this message because you got hair. Oh my god! I mean, a lot of niggas ain't got their hair. It's worse though when you that's see hilarious. when you see her like hair later you. on, and she with a nigga that's not on your level. You're like, bitch, are you serious? Oh, when I be on Facebook god. and I see like who they say they follow, that make me not like certain bitches. Ooh, when wait, I see I've done that. I have you done follow that. this nigga? Oh, <laughs> bitch, you ain't about shit. Oh, I've seen people oh, make comments, god. and I'm like, ew. Yeah, I've seen some people that I've had respect for, and I've seen them make a comment to some. Oof. Yeah, I totally changed. Yeah, turn I see me what you, off. Yeah, I see what you mean. Turn me off. Cause niggas be thirsty on them Instagram bitches page. Yeah, so you might know them. So. And you see, uh oh. Yeah. And nigga, you talking to yourself. Yeah. Right. <laughs> you don't even know who you are. Right. You just, <laughs> unless you cash you look good in that nigga. Yeah. Shut the fuck yeah. up. She don't it's, even it's, know who you are. It's a lot of girls on the internet that are fuckable. Whenever you can DM them, you know you can fuck them. Right. 
Because the ones you can't fuck, you can't DM them. They no. don't want to hear shit. I but if you know. can DM them, you can fuck them. Can we write that on a shirt? If you can DM the bitch, she is trying to if see what's answers, up out here. If she answers your DM. If she answers the there DM. There you go. That's the thing. Because you can DM all you no, like. I call no. it having a conversation like you said with I yourself. I like the DMs though. When niggas be sending me dick pics and shit, right. it make my spirit. Ew, I'm going to shit like I'm popping out here. Baby. Oh, girl. Oh, I get so many dick uh-huh. pics. It's crazy. I'm going to show you my spirit. Yeah, yeah. Like let, let a nigga I'm talking to talk shit to me. I'll be like, nigga, Popeye95 said I can get it. Uh-huh. I can get it, nigga. You got me fucked up. If I answer one of these DMs, nigga, pussy gone. Nigga, you don't even know me. I'm out here. DM, uh, no, you, you sugar-coated it, Darlene. No, I was going to say, she she won't like that stalker fool that I got, huh? That was gross. Oh. That's disgusting. Hey, I had a stalker. Oh, he, She'll like him. Was, no. and She'll I was like kind of flattered a little bit, but then I was like, he crazy. But no, then I was like... You. Why niggas don't do this for real? But I was like, he crazy. But I didn't have, I ain't never had that much attention. So oh, I, like, I don't know if I don't like. I'm That's not what I said. Like this shit, but damn, this nigga is taking the initiative. <laughs> <laughs> too much, too much initiative on this. If you can DM anybody, you can fuck them. Remember no, that. That is not true. It people you can't wrong. DM, they not open to fucking strangers. But if you can DM them, you can fuck them. But a lot of people can get through the DM, but it's if you respond. You can be DM, can't you? No. Oh, you, got your, you got yours blocked. Look, I can't DM stay. me, nigga. No. Hold on, but people stay. I don't know if this happened to you, but people stay hitting me about Darlene. Well, Darlene at least fine. two or three a week. They be like, Ever since I've been knowing Darlene, I get so many niggas talking about they know her or whatever, and they be trying to find out information about people. Right. What they I be know? peeping the game. Soon as, soon as, first of all, as soon as you know? say somebody else's name to me, I'm already looking at you like, right, right, yeah, right, 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 right. What the fuck you talking about? This? What you want to know? I ain't been involved with for this shit. Right, right, right. <laughs> Every once in a while, somebody get past my motherfucking radar. No. Right, right. One day I was talking about this other bitch, this one bitch, and then it got back to me. I was like, God damn it, I <laughs> fucked her. I knew oh she was going to tell that bitch. That's, yeah. that's why she DM'd, see? She didn't even have to DM. She got right up in there. Well, we, it was just the yeah. shit. You know, sometimes people talk shit on the phone. We, sometimes when you on the phone, you wind up talking shit about, about somebody, somebody and, and then, you yeah. be catching yourself. Let me uh, shut the fuck up. Yeah. I don't know why too I late, said that. Yep. Too late. Too I had to say it. Yeah. Hey, what you do when the broads DM you? Because I get them all the time. You I, get DMs? All the time. But you answer them back? I say, send me a video, say my name in the video and what, what, the purpose that you DM me. And they do it? Oh, because you oh, want to make sure it's really them. Yeah. You don't want to get catfish. So, catfish. No, I'm saying if you if you DM me because you think I'm attractive, say, hey, Craig, I think you're an attractive man. And, and so I'm he's going to ask his sister to do it. Why are you no. setting the bitches up, dog? <laughs> I need pride. You are evil. No, nah, I'm not going to sh- I'm not gonna show nobody. But it can but always but still be catfished. You're going to show be- somebody. Everything on the internet is game for right. the system. Hey, yeah, okay. Everything you yeah. text I'm is gonna, part of the game. But it ain't, yeah, I, I, yeah, you're right. If a bitch put a filter on, it's okay, Craig. She oh, make her oh, stomach a little smaller. Oh, oh, you niggas be catfishing us too. Yeah. I like a uh-huh. woman that got a, a handful of stomach. If I can grab her by her stomach <laughs> and bring her close to me by it, that's the type of woman. So I don't give a fuck about no bad bitch. I like that though. Craig. I like You're six and a half to eight. That's my range. I don't do nothing outside of that. What why happened? You, why are you exaggerating? If you say the bitch ain't got to be bad, an eight is good, nigga. An eight, you but you fuck with on average. On average, what do you fuck with? Seven and a half. Seven and a half. That's my that's my lane. Even when I'm papered up, seven. And a half. I don't why like. Why do you torture that. yourself like I that? Can't Make a, I mean, they they they, they, they are, they're regular thinkers. Sevens are our team players, but fives are loyal. They uh, realize you are opportunity. Uh, right, right, somebody right. Fuck with a five. Somebody said Popeye song, please. That's fun. <laughs> but see, no, but if you, if, uh-uh. no, the other one. Oh, the other one. If you, if you want Corey to come in at uh, that moment, with if that you other fuck other with a five one. and you a seven, that means your kids gonna be uglier than you. Who gonna knock a bitch out? Well, I'm older doing than doing you, so oh, I'm, okay. I'm different than you, Craig. Yeah. <laughs> no, too ugly. How old are make you? A I'm 38. Yeah, your seed's still swimming strong. Yeah, hell yeah, hell yeah. When I beat off, I gotta go like that. Oh, my God. I gotta, I gotta, I gotta juke myself, nigga, for oh. respect. Hell yeah, but bitch, tell me she pregnant about me. I be like, bitch, get your lying ass out of here. <laughs> can't get no bitches pregnant no more, bitch. Get the fuck out of here. You really can. You better be careful. I know. You really say, can. How, how you couldn't? 
What's that about? Oh, yeah. What? No, but every time you tell them, I can't get bitches pregnant, they always oh, be like, so wrong. okay, well, it might have been somebody else. That's what I thought, bitch. <laughs> oh, oh. The old trickery. The oh, old these old bitches trickery. is retarded. I hope mine. What you I ain't telling on myself. <laughs> I don't look like that. Hey. Ugh. <laughs> this one bitch tried that shit recently. I was like, bitch, I can't get bitches pregnant no more. I got fixed. She was like, well, I was going to tell you my period came today, but I didn't know. I was like, ah, ah scandalous yeah. bitch. <laughs> Praise God. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus. Lord have mercy. Oh, shit, Corona. No, I'm fucking with you. Oh, That's some real shit, It bro. was a story like that about a man that had got his... Um, Mm. Got a vasectomy and his wife got pregnant. She let him have a baby and everything. I seen something. And it was somebody else's. Yeah, and it let was her had a baby. Wow. Mm-hmm. Say that yeah. again. Like the nigga had a vasectomy behind her back, I guess. His wife. And she came up pregnant and he didn't even say nothing to her. He let her have a baby and everything. I was like, bitch. That's a great, <gasps> that's a Ooh, great story. Okay, line. I see. I like get that one. Nigga, that's that a is. whole fucking, yeah. what, that's a whole show right there. I wish mm. I would be motherfucking fixing a bitch I'm fucking with get pregnant. I ain't going to say shit either. I'm going to just like Ooh. that. Just don't sign anything at the hospital because that's it. That's You'll gold be right there. You'll be shit. liable. The storyline I got is gold, nigga. Mm. Is that right? Yeah, that bit when my best my friend started fucking my daddy. Oh, wow. Mm. <laughs> that should have happened. Yeah, I had that happen. <laughs> yeah. like, you know, my daddy got a little bread. She started fucking him. Yeah. Well, I mean, he just a real bitch. Bitches to do that. The whole family uproar. I tried to kill that bitch. Really? Yeah. You ain't supposed to end up becoming your yeah. stepmom, bitch. Me you? and my daddy wasn't speaking or nothing, but you know. Why can't you call was you? Why you mad at your daddy because he fucking your your friend? Because the nigga was treating her better than he was treating me. Like, <laughs> oh, <laughs> <a> goddamn <laughs> men. <laughs> Shit. The fuck? Well, you know what you need to do? The fuck is going on? You know what you need to do, right? Shit. You need to give your daddy some pussy. Nigga, my daddy. <laughs> oh, my Praise God. You better show him what this family about. Now bring God, God in. Now bring God in. Goodness. That is sake. God. Oh my God. You stupid. That word Jesus. came from the Lord. Man. God. God. Yeah, ain't, not, ain't nothing like saying, give it to me, Daddy, on the real oh. side of it. Yeah. <laughs> Shit, that's how the white folks do it. Fuck I'll it. fuck one of my daughter friends. Don't do that. I'll show it. Look, these bitches ain't shit. Fuck you mad at me for. If the bitch gave a fuck about either one of us, she wouldn't have fucked me. That's what I told my daddy. He didn't give a Like, she like me. She probably don't like you. Oh, like, nigga, what the uh, fuck? I don't agree with nigga. both of y'all on Did that Did he stay shit. with her? Huh? What her Did fucking he mean? No, to because do? my daddy is my daddy is hella old, so he ended up getting sick. It's all kind of shit going on with him. Hell no, nah, but mm-hmm. she got a lot out of him though, cause you know he yeah. worked. Your I daddy. seen I seen the bank statements and shit. I, I, now whose fault is it? It's his, but yeah. I'm just no. saying. No, oh, oh, it's oh, your was, fault. Oh, I tried. You can't bring no scandalous bitches around your people. I didn't know. Me and her was cool. <laughs> I didn't know. She was my real. You didn't wait. We was doing some real estate. No, shit and fuck I wanted that. To I, I'd have peeped you. You too smart. No. Nah. You yeah, know bitches really... ain't shit. Oh my you god. You know bitches ain't shit. Ain't nowhere in the world you gonna make me think okay. you was around a well, bitch and didn't right, know that bitch right. was shit. I know she was a little shady, but I didn't think she would fuck my old ass daddy. Now that's the truth. That's the truth right there. You right. You right. How much that's older? the truth how much right older? there. She she is only a little bit older than me. She was like no, forty five, and my daddy eighty. Oh no. Yeah. Oh, I fuck oh, with pops. No. I fuck with your daddy still get an erection. No, not no more. Oh, okay. everything dead on him. How you oh. know? Oh, my God, nigga. I, ch- I changed them, nigga. Everything oh. is dead. Nigga. Oh, okay. <laughs> I feel you. Yeah. I feel you. I feel you on yeah. that. I know what you're saying. Yeah. Uh-huh. Damn. I wonder if I was old and I don't give a fuck. I don't, if my, my daughter was changing me, I think my dick would get off. Uh, well, all I got to say is niggas better be nice to their daughters because that's who the fuck going to take, take care of you. It depends on yeah. if you know who you are. Straight up. Well, well, well that's, that, that, that thing you just said is 100% some mm-hmm. real shit. Mm-hmm. The people you got around you yeah. need to be motherfuckers who fuck with you for real, especially as you get older in life. Yeah. Because if you an old nigga mm. and you got motherfucking ain't shit people around you, and That's I'm it. talking about w- women and men, nigga, you going out bad. Bad. Right. Yeah. Bad. You going You'll out neglected. bad. They'll take it out. They of can yeah. make you sign shit, power of attorneys, all that. You don't have no control. Right. Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. That's why I had to go take over all kind of shit. But My homeboy, his yeah. uh, his father died, unfortunately, and the bitch he was with was moving him from hospital to hospital to hide him from the family so see? she can get that death certificate. Mm, mm-hmm. 
Oh, no, nah, I'd have killed that bitch. Yeah, I feel you, but I'm talking about Nothing for real. Nothing you can do when it's already far gone and you're just too old and you're just, or not even old, but you're sick. Well, my daddy, when it comes to my daddy, it ain't never over. It yeah, could be 10 years. Yeah, but I know, years. that's how I felt, too. It was, I my to daddy, that bitch? Too. Oh. That's when you're supposed to kill bitches, when it's your family. My I'm daddy. Like, I'm supposed to kill. I'm telling niggas, like, I'm, this is when you're yeah. supposed to fuck it against all odds type shit. But mm -hmm. everybody like, your career. I'm like, niggas will respect me if I go to jail for killing bitches. <laughs> 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 I'll come out and do a special yeah, about it. Again, you don't even but know. You That's how the, disrespected I felt. Yeah. I'm like, the fuck that bitch When you in court for that murder, you want the judge to be like, well, really, you just handle your business. I ain't going to give you three years. I ain't going to give you three years. That bitch had it coming. Yeah, hey, that's yeah. real spit. Three yeah. years in jail, that ain't shit. You just no. going to miss a couple of sports mm. centers. All right. Oh, oh. You know what? We missing them not. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Motherfucker, I ain't singing that Popeye song no, no more, motherfucker. <laughs> Fuck y'all, nigga. I sung that shit about 50 times. <laughs> that shit was funny. Oh, yeah. yeah. So we gonna go on here. I mean, we kicking this. This These type of conversations are easy when you're dealing with talent. Mm. And I'm just saying, it's like, I'm, I'm glad you're here, sister. I'm glad you're here. It was so many things tried to stop this meeting from happening. I know. And now we good. We good. Good, uh, I want to come back. <laughs> look, look, let me tell you something. Come back whenever you want to come back. Okay, that's what's up. Y'all heard him. Cause come Corey back be giving you the number back. and don't answer the phone. He'll pump a bitch up. A nigga give you. Well, you a, you uh, a girl. At the same time, like. You a girl. <laughs> <laughs> a nigga no, we, we good now. You straight. You okay. straight. We, I'm, okay. we, we straight. We just and you live here meet. in L.A. too, right? Yeah, so that'll be LA. easy. See, that'll be easier. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute, yeah. I thought you didn't live in L.A. No, I live here. I just told you I'm handling business in Alabama. Just, oh, so you going to be here? I'm a, No, I'm leaving Thursday, but I'll be back in like May. I'm oh, I fucked up. Well, you can't come back when you want to. Call me oh, first. No. Oh, okay. <laughs> okay. She could. You would No, but when I get back out here on this road, man, I'm going to show 5150 well, Nation. Alabama, so call me. I'll come open up for you. Yeah, I'm talking about like, but when you free up. When you got that time, let me know. Because okay. I want motherfuckers. I, I, it's, I, it actually feel good to have a funny female to offset the shit I say. That's what I've been looking for. Yeah. A girl who can hold her own. And they own. keep saying that, but I'm telling, I told them a couple of weeks ago that this is my last year, so it would be a perfect replacement. Oh, D, talk about getting replaced. D. Hey. No, no, no. I told you a couple of weeks ago that this I'm is my last year. I'm going away. Well, he got her man. He don't, no, he don't I don't. But twenty, no I, I thought it'd be a good time to step back. A nice ten year even anniversary. Yeah. yeah. He ain't got this no is our way to go. Y'all yeah. put ten man, in. How the hell he gonna tell me I'm not what I'm not gonna do? He ain't got no way to go. Trust me. Excuse me. He got a popping restaurant. When I, I need to come to your yeah. restaurant. That's gonna my make Corey restaurant. cry. Oh, okay. yeah, no, no I'm gonna show you a clip from so many years back with this same shit. I did not. I've never said that. I have never said that. You didn't? No. Remember no. you said that. I don't I don't recall myself actually having a year that I said, okay, that was it. Yeah, I was like, no. Twenty I think this is fine because it's perfect date. 2020. Ten years. This is our tenth anniversary. Mm. Damn. The girls be talking, man. <laughs> you gonna make Corey cry in this No, I don't. Oh, no, motherfucker, I, I ain't gonna yeah, cry. Nigga, beer yeah. gonna be wet in exactly. a few minutes. Exactly. I don't think yeah. so. <laughs> no, but, motherfucker, your ass gonna cry, motherfucker. You remember we had the female call challenge on this motherfucker? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Ain't nothing wrong with crying shit. Every time I beat a bitch up, she cry. Ain't nothing wrong with. Oh, stop, Craig. I don't even. You cry that. too, Craig. I do not believe he does that. <laughs> after you beat him up, I don't beat up no bitches up to No, after you beat a bitch ass, you gotta cry with her so she don't. Call the police. <laughs> I don't think Craig does that. You got to put on that. Uh, what's that nigga's name? Uh, damn, the nigga with the raspy voice, uh, Murder Inc. Nigga. Ja Rule. He had that song. Remember, I cry, we cry, some shit. Oh I my forgot. god. What's oh the, lord. How that song go? Ja Rule not gonna make her make up with you. No. <laughs> <laughs> it worked. Not him. <laughs> Somebody it else, worked. baby. But not always him. there when you call. <laughs> yeah, <ass laughs> yeah no. there we go. Hell yeah. yeah. All right, so we're going to get to the part of the show that will soon be to an end. Oh, brother. You could rename it. <laughs> we will, nigga. Oh, I know you will. Oh, now, oh, I this moved up to the N word. Oh. Oh, did I call you, nigga? You ain't yes, no nigga. You did. Oh. <laughs> what, like what is your um, derogatory um, racist term? Beaner. Beaner? Probably. Beaner, Wet yeah. back. Wet back? Spit. Yeah. <laughs> What's the, mm. the Mexican shit? Spit. Spanish is Spit, spit, uh, yeah. No, that's for those in the East Coast. Oh, they don't Puerto Rican. Uh, yeah. 
You don't say that out here? Nah. Oh, okay. It's a lot in the gang world. It's a lot. I don't want to say none of them because well, I don't, no, don't. don't want to be no yeah. target. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? But you, You'll be a target if you say something? Hell gringo? Yeah. gringo? What is that's a gringo? A, that's, for, that's a white dude. Yeah. He's like, white dude. Yeah. I'm like, what? Uh. All right. Uh, All right this not? is D's loose talk <laughs> about <laughs> bullshit. <laughs> Thank you very much. Okay, right. D. Come on with this bullshit. So, as we know it, many ways of living. Not much longer, y'all. Oh, God. <laughs> Who can go? Okay, all right. It's a challenge Just now. Just tolerate it. It's a challenge now. All right. As we know it, many Leave ways. Leave us. Oh, no, my bad. God, Jesus. I know I fuck you up done? your read. My bad. Are Get, you done? Put your eye on it. I ain't going to fuck it up no more. My eye on it. You know you can't see, nigga. Why don't you put your new cataract eyes on it, Bill Cosby? As we know it, many ways of living will change due to what's happening right now. So what do you think about this idea? I don't know if you heard about this. You know our, our guy Van Jones, right? You know who Van Jones is? Mm-hmm. You know who uh, TMC? Attorney, commentator, author. Um, he's also the co-founder of like several nonprofit organizations. Van Jones. There right here. I don't guy. know who that nigga is. You know who Van Jones is. Smart dude, man. Oh, the gay dude off CNN. Go okay. Ahead. All right. Well, what what he's what he's um what he's speaking on right now is the passing of a law called the Compassionate Release, which he believes would allow for the releasing of qualifying prisoners, meaning any low-level and non-violent offenders should be released ASAP before they contact the virus, because, as he put it, mm. that prison um, is a petri dish for the virus. Van Indeed. says that in order to protect society as a whole. This should be implemented because if this thing hits the prison systems, it will be a catastrophe to add to what's already happening. Um, He said that uh, the government has the power and opportunity to nip this in the bud. He believes that an act like that could prevent prisons from becoming super accelerators of the COVID-19. So right now he's it. on a mission yeah. to push that, huh? Well, the, the, the industrial prison complex, they going to keep them niggas alive. You know what I'm saying? They, need, they, they work. They them, need man. that work. They yeah. need that free labor. They going to take yeah. better care of them than they do us on the outside. That's some real shit. Niggas go to jail, get full Teeth porcelain fixed, grills. Kind of they yeah. come out healthy. So, As you probably already heard yeah. that Harvey Weinstein has it. Really? Yeah. They just, okay. com- they just confirmed that he has it. He probably got a lot of but shit. But my cousin in jail, they, this, it's <laughs> been in there. It's, they, they've, it's been in there for like what the prison he's at. Mm-hmm. It's been 20 cases of that in like the last month and a half. Of what? Of COVID. COVID. Mm-hmm. Wow. Mm-mm. I mean, you know it's going to be in the jail. Hell yeah. Oh, mm. Hell That's yeah. how you get out. Oh. That nigga got COVID. I'm about to fuck the shit out of this <laughs> nigga. <laughs> <laughs> fuck, up out fuck COVID niggas. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm about to co visit that asshole. Yeah. So COVID. I can get That's out of two jail. niggas your asshole. Co visit. Right. I'm in here for child support. I'm about to get the fuck out of here. Come here, nigga. <laughs> <laughs> now I think that's fucked up. Yeah. Right. That niggas go to jail for child support. Right. That's fucked up. That don't even make no sense. Yeah. You should be. Why don't they give niggas a job? That's what I was gonna say. Your punishment should be get a job within a certain time, or or you, you go back find every. I'd rather go to jail Nothing. than get a job and like, give a bitch my check. You out your mind? Bullshit. Lock me up. <laughs> you know, that's why a lot of people don't work because they're like, forget it. I don't want to give her a dime. So I've I've had people in my family that said, I'm just not gonna work at all. You know what's the first thing you' supposed to say when a girl is pregnant and she on that shit, bitch? Why you keep mine? Right. Oh. <laughs> because I told God that last abortion was the last one. It don't got nothing to do with you. <laughs> but Stop. That's, that's not it, though. Oh, my God. That's not it, it's though. It's about me and God. Now, I done had too many. You just the nigga that got me pregnant after I promised God. <laughs> after that last abortion, this what be didn't happen, fellas. That machine and sucked that pussy forward so many times, the pussy face in the street. So they be like, I ain't having another one. This is ridiculous. My pussy look like a lemon between my legs. Yeah, that's <laughs> so. That's what the machine do is suck. It pull it. How you think the baby get out of there? Okay. Yeah, you ever seen? Oh, you don't know, but you no, ever I never seen, seen one. You ever seen what um when they what they do to dogs' balls when they go in there to fix them and it kind of it's a little machine it goes in it tears everything apart and it just sucks out that's what they do to kind them. of it I jamba would... juice the baby <laughs> they, they do that to dogs balls when they fix them too. bitches be saying playing parenthood because it sounds nice tell the truth i'm about to jamba juice this little motherfucker oh, yeah. oh, God, jamba juice. we don't know what happened <laughs> <laughs> 
switched it up. <laughs> they don't let niggas in there. He don't really know what happened. And I what was, was in there. The clinic I went to. You the, went. They the, let you in. The doctor know me. Uh 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 uh. He's uh-uh, like, uh-uh. you here? Come on, uh-uh. nigga. <laughs> y'all friend, y'all took selfies right. after. Come on, she sleep, nigga. Come <laughs> on in there. <laughs> Anyway. That's funny. Uh, man. So you want to so, see the pussy before I fuck it up? I can't. He's about to bleed for a month and a half after this. <laughs> okay. At least. So of course, so of course, you're hearing about a lot of funny stories in regards to how everyone's coping with isolating in their homes now, especially with loved ones, and it doesn't exclude people like Oprah. What's happening in her situation is she actually had to put out Stedman. So he's. <laughs> he, <laughs> He is staying in, um, in, in the guest house in the back, which isn't such a bad thing if you look at it, because they actually posted a picture of him. He's hanging out like the window or whatever. No, happened. that's a lie, D. No, she they said. Him. That motherfucker said, I will not oh, fuck you shush. again, bro. Uh, anyway, they, they, <laughs> so what happened was she said she actually had to put him out there that he's staying in the guest house while she's quarantining herself in her home in Santa Barbara. In an interview recently, she admitted that her longtime partner, Stedman, is staying in the guest house to separately self-isolate to protect her health. She says because she's more, um, she's more at risk because she's had pneumonia before, and she just actually went off her last meds regarding that ammonia at the end of last year, which not a lot of people knew of. Um, and she said she just went off bronchial meds, which would really affect her if she caught something like this. Um, they said, then she said it's Stedman's fault that he's not able to be by her side because she said he was one of those people that didn't end up taking the COVID-19 crisis seriously enough and was late to the party, as she put it, getting on board um, with taking all the precautions. She said that he flew recently from Chicago to California this past Thursday, and then when he asked her before he arrived, hey, what's the procedure when I get there to your house? She said, oh, you're not coming up here in my, she actually used these words, to sleep in my bed. And she said she told him that he'd have to, he has to pay attention to news, social distancing does not mean that you go to sleep in the same bed with the person that just got off an American Airlines flight. So he said he had no problem with it, and he's happy to help keep her safe, and that he's bringing bot meals daily, and that they oh have their God. love chats from window to window. I know. What a soft-ass, bitch-made-ass nigga. He's a <laughs> How the <laughs> fuck is we... Oh! <laughs> That's what my... Gail got ass, though. Uh, I wish I would, motherfucker, had some bitch telling me where the fuck I'm asleep, and you supposed to be fucking with me. Right. Bitch, if you don't shut the fuck up, well, we, in ain't, that we case, ain't in though, front of the TV cameras. But in that case, though, Oprah is the weight holder. In other words, she she's carries the ends, and the, she's damn He had the to man. fuck you her after, after that color purple movie when the dress blew up. <laughs> that is, bitch, you owe him. He been with her for a long time. Oh, yeah. mm-hmm. You owe him. God yeah, damn it. Yeah. Right. Oh. Like, we let him do that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, she be letting mm-hmm. Todd do. <laughs> yeah, we might have to, you might take it. She be letting Todd have businesses. <laughs> Cause that's what you do for your nigga when you really respect him and you you know you love him and he just don't have as much as you. you no, know? that's what you but do. She been bitching that nigga. She can't. Mm-hmm. Right. Like, well, mm. that's what you do when you got one of them niggas. Cause mm. a motherfucking real nigga don't give a fuck what the fuck you got. Goddamn it, bitch. That's true. You not finna talk crazy to me. You ain't finna run shit. God damn it, we gonna compromise, and you ain't gonna put shit out in the media like that for people like D to read. Oh, stop. <laughs> it, she put it, he, he, she, he allowed it? You That's gotta, what I'm he saying, he's kick. a cake mix ass nigga. It's a video, it's funny as hell. He's I play this, ball with the nigga before. Window. When oh, really? he play ball, his hands hang oh, a lot. My God. That's a sign of gay oh, shit. Oh my God. You mean they go behind him like he's running? This nigga's 75, you play ball with him? Man, when we was in high school, we had a celebrity game. Okay. There they and go. he came through. He was older, of course. He yeah. looked he old still, right there. That's this you know, year. he tall. He was with her back He's then? He's very tall. He's, He's been with her like, like But I noticed when he, when he was running down the court, he put his hands low and out. I was like, that's gay shit, nigga. And I was a young nigga and I peaked that. He had was, game, though? He just a big motherfucker. He all right. I told him big seven. motherfucker. Probably about six four. Oh, yeah, you told me. Yeah, Oprah fucked with him because back in them days, it wasn't cool to be gay. She couldn't come out. Right. right. Everybody mm. had cover ups. Like that bitch. He um, stepped to her with Dookie. With she stepped to him with Coochie. I don't give a fuck. <laughs> Which one? Star Jones' husband. I can't believe she walked down the aisle with that nigga. He blaming. What's his name? Uh, uh, who was that? Al. 
Nigga. Al. Al Reynolds. Al Reynolds. I think it was on the Housewives picking out shoes with Evelyn after that divorce thing. I was what? like, what? <laughs> <laughs> but look who didn't no, didn't Jennifer Hudson nigga. marry oh, a nigga? That's our new nigga, huh? Didn't Jennifer Hudson marry a nigga that was obviously flaming? Oh, oh. We nigga. used to hoop with that nigga 24 hour fitness. He was on the I Love New York. Remember? After yes, the in the beginning. Shit? Yeah, yeah. That nigga, they called him a. His name was a bitch nigga on the show. Yeah, he was on the show. His name was Punk. Oh, that's right. Yeah. It was. And his I didn't even know this. It's just I'm a man, nigga. I play ball with the nigga at the gym. I'm, oh, my you know, God. just because he a fan don't mean I talk shit to him. But when he got married, I was like, that nigga got that jackpot. Uh, yeah, cause they had two like, kids, one or yeah, two kids, something like that. Yeah, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. that boy can still suck in that bottle. Got them. Well, Oprah, oh, Oprah Lord, was anyway. a penny stock when Stedman got her, though. So what? he, she was a penny stock. She was a light investment. You know what I mean? She wasn't worth much. Man, get the fuck out of here. Oprah, Oprah was on no. NBC, yeah, been, yeah, nigga. Yeah, yeah. yeah. For a long Do you know time. what even, network television yeah, is, even, nigga? Even, yeah. This ain't oh, cable, no. nigga. Yeah, when network, yeah, back then too, yeah. Oprah was on in How long has she been B-O-C. on? on. Like, how long has she been on? Since on. you was a baby, nigga. Yeah. Okay. Uh, for real. Yeah. For real? Yeah. yeah. Oprah got Our paper, nigga. Yeah. Since we was baby, yes. Yeah. Yes. Okay. Yeah. yeah. My bad. I thought she That was bitch good. got a magazine. Yeah, Oprah got and a her first That's in the grocery yeah, store. Yeah. These bitches out here hustling their magazines off their Instagram. <laughs> Oh, oh, nigga. oh, I get I'm here not. to tell you, nigga. I know what paper is, nigga. And, and, that, and that own building over there in West Hollywood takes up like a whole block. Yeah, I don't fucking yeah. <laughs> and it's always appealed to She's right there in West Hollywood. Like, she got a studio out here? Yeah. We weren't redecorating our homes. We didn't need, you Oprah know, hate yeah. real niggas. Yeah. She Oprah, you like, ain't no, never seen a real nigga next to Oprah. Name mm-hmm. one. Name one real nigga you saw next to Oprah. Okay, I can do it, mm-hmm. nigga. Uh, you can't. Oh, Lord. You she nigga. don't fuck with alpha males. Farrakhan was on her show. That's the no, realest of the real. No, not on the show. Friends, like hanging out. Okay. I ain't friends. even talking about friends. You said Farrakhan was on Oprah's show. Wasn't he on Oprah? I've been on Oprah's show. I, well, I'm thinking about Donahue. I'm thinking I about Donahue. Yeah. Okay. I was just going to say, I got to do this research. You telling uh, me Oprah had back in the Farrakhan? Day, you know, she's had a lot the of- The ultimate the alpha day, male? The she, ultimate man? But anybody Ooh, could go on her show because they could actually not be trying a fair to break you down. Time. You nah. know, a lot of- You lot say of, anybody could go on her show? What real nigga was on her show? Back in the day, a lot of people would, but that's because they were trying to challenge you and break you down over to whatever it was that your your topic was. Okay, I hear what you're saying. Because we were on there. When y'all get through, now, somebody said real nigga. So, okay, motherfucker said, motherfucker said Dave Chappelle. Motherfucker said Dave Chappelle. He'd be around her. He was on Oprah? Dave Chappelle, safe. Yeah, oh, but he wasn't on the Oprah show. She interviewed him. Dave Chappelle. that little no, talk thing. No, let me make sure I clear this up. Dave Chappelle... Had a controlled interview, and I could tell he wasn't finna. Dave, let me tell you something. Dave Chappelle did the realest shit in the world. He told them motherfuckers, "Fuck you." He right. did on, the, on that interview. Motherfuckers yeah. be talking shit about oh. what they do when they make it. Dave Chappelle told them people, "Fuck you." I ain't, I ain't cooning out. Bernie so Mac. when they did interview him, he was. He was actually saying some real shit. He did. Mm-hmm. He said something of an African analogy or some shit. Yeah. That was real deep. Yeah. Bar- Bernie Mac went on the show. I forgot. That's a real nigga. Mm. Here we go. So can we segue? Because <laughs> you guys did bring up so basketball. Bernie Mac was real I mean, I ain't never met him. You ever met meet him? him? I ain't never oh, met Lord, him. Oh, Lord, here we go. I ain't taking nothing away from Bernie Mac. Yeah. But if Bernie Mac was on motherfucking Oprah Winfrey show, he was, he was safe. Right. But it depends on what you were on there about. Are you right, on there right. to interest? What do you mean up there about? Are you on there to I remember promote? one day they did a movie. I forgot the movie. She had every motherfucker from the cast except Mike Epps. Damn. Yeah, that's some punk ass shit. She had everybody from the cast except Mike Epps. She made sure Mike Epps wasn't there because she can't control him. That's some real shit. She can't control what he say. I'm saying like, but back in the day when she used to be Donna Hewish, in other words, yeah. like she had the people oh, yeah. like arguing and fighting, because we were on there with Tipper Gore and everybody during that whole. Oh, I still a real nigga. Yeah, we were on it. We were on there. There he go, hater. There he go, <laughs> talk and say it. What the fuck I say? I, I didn't say nothing. You give that face, but you ain't gonna say you gave a face, a weird face, <laughs> didn't he? And took a drink. Like, uh, oh, okay, uh huh. Cop killer. I don't know. I don't know Ice T like that. <laughs> okay, well that's so what I'm, I'm saying. not so gonna, say, gonna say. Y'all was on Oprah. Yeah. You I was on there talking too, right? Yeah, I was eighteen. Oprah wants some pussy. 
Oh, <laughs> oh my God! Now that might be facts, darling. She, that she might said be that facts. Covers it. I got to have this bitch on the show. <laughs> man. But you know what the real niggas know? I, I was not. in the audience. Was she was audience. trying to bump you from Ice T. I was in the audience. No, she was not. You was there, right? Yeah, on the break, I she didn't ask you, was he hurting you? I spoke to her. <laughs> she actually came out. Are you safe, darling? Uh, that's she actually funny. came out before the whole show to talk to us. Just Somebody by said Michael Jordan. Come on, man. Michael Jordan ain't no real nigga. Oh, Michael Jordan was go. the greatest basketball player I've ever seen in my life, but mm. he wasn't no real nigga. Yeah. He ain't never said no real shit. And as a mother, fuck that And when he did all do all some real shit, they, shit. When, when they did do some real shit, they kicked his ass out of a fucking uh, All Star weekend mm. when they wouldn't uh, 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 acknowledge the fruit booty shit that's going on, the fruit booty epidemic. Mm, mm, mm. Oh, I'm glad Ooh, you brought up that's taboo again. if you say that. <laughs> oh, Lord. <laughs> Women who eat pussy are natural people. Men who fuck men are the problem. There you go. Ain't nothing wrong with a woman eating pussy. Goddamn it, that's motherfucking. That's your. That's your main girl. She go get bitches for you. And it's pressure on her to come back with bad bitches. You be like, that's who you fucking out here, bitch? You might as well stop fucking bitches then. Mm-mm. Mm-hmm. That's real nigga come. Being a lesbian is like playing flag football, nigga. It's, it's, a, it's a whole lot of contact, but ain't nobody really getting that's hit. That's what I'm saying. I agree with Chris. No, so there's some bitches out here. Who I got, need a finish line, bitch. I need a. She I don't need to finish. Though. You get hit. Sarah used to do These it. These bitches nah. show up. <laughs> if it ain't no but balls might, involved, I might, I might, ain't I no might, balls involved. I might, I might but them walls get dissolved. Women like women. These hoes got toys. <laughs> you see <laughs> this thermo? Yeah, they fit that These hoes show up yanking this out, you bitch. Yeah, no. that's the worst. Yeah, that is. Let's get one. And it don't be warm, Corey. It's cold. It's cold. We'll bitches. put it in the microwave. No, no. Oh, my God. I need a vein, and I need it to uh, pulsate. Not, bitches a, fuck with bitches. That's it. Because it's, it's a guaranteed real. nut. That that's pulsation is, is a sign you're doing something right. Hell, yeah. yeah. Whatever a dick do this, <laughs> you're doing oh something Lord. right. Any pulsation is good. Pulsation. Pulsation Here leads to eruption. Oh. Pulsation. All you girls who don't know what you're doing, keep doing what you're doing until you feel something pulsating. Then don't don't stop. Just keep doing that until it <laughs> happens. It's gonna happen. Shaniqua All real says, women Shaniqua went Town's home doing business. This. She says she needs some real meat. <laughs> yeah, we what'd need you say? Some real meat. No, Tanika, there's somebody on this that I need some real meat. Yeah, I get frustrated. Like, bitch, stop eating my pussy. It's the third time. Oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <Real spirit. laughs> Without no balls, it ain't no breaks on the sex. They just I'm keep good. going. That shit is greed. Being a lesbian is greed. If it ain't no balls these involved. Bitches got, these bitches got toys with balls. Okay. That's what they poke it in. They <laughs> hold the balls while they poking the bitch. Yeah, but, oh. but how, how do it stop, They though? need to build dildos with handles. <laughs> <laughs> like mm-hmm. an umbrella handle yeah. on the bottom of that Lord <laughs> exactly. Want me to open it up, no. bitch? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. No, I'm fucking right. with you. Ain't nothing either. wrong with lesbian sex, though. It ain't no. That's what I said. Ain't nothing ain't wrong no, with lesbian yeah. sex. Lesbian sex is beautiful. It is. It ain't men no. Men fucking men is disrespectful mm. to God. The oh, only problem with it go. is here when uh, when 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 women view it as a replacement for a man as opposed to an alternative. Say that again. Lesbian sex is not a replacement for men. It should be used as an alternative. You know what I'm saying? It's no. Like, this is what I found out the hard way. It's women who like to eat. Pussy. Right. You can't do nothing about that. Right. Right. Well. What you gonna do if a girl like to eat pussy? What you gonna do? I'm you fine. can't stop her. I'm fine I sure that. ain't gonna try to stop her. No. no. <laughs> Don't you do that no That's more. how you learn. Watching right. another woman eat some pussy. That's some real shit. You sitting there at the edge of the bed and they realize you ain't gonna come over there, they start to relax more. Right. When they think you coming over there, they be tense. But when you just relax on the edge of the bed and just be having your drink, they be like, oh, he gonna let me eat this pussy. I'm like, oh, hey, oh, shit, I wanna God. watch. Hey. What? Some women do like to eat pussy. That's real spit, though. There's girls out here who like to eat pussy. They can't stop eating pussy. I know how it feel to want to eat some pussy. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I look like trying to stop somebody from wanting to eat some pussy. Like, oh, you want some pussy? Okay, we're gonna eat the pussy then. Shit, I'll wait. They said, Corey got cheated on by a woman with a woman. They did what? They just said that. Corey the, got the, cheated on with a woman by a woman. That that happened too. No shit, are. ain't no shame. Mm. I had a bitch mm-hmm. take my bitch. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's some cold bitches out here. 
That's some real shit, man. Mm-hmm. What? I had a bitch take my bitch. The bitch had money and everything. Right. I had a boss ass bitch take my bitch when I was a motherfucking New Jack comic nigga. Right. He proud a of bitch it. took my bitch. He's proud that, of it. I couldn't compete with that bitch paper. That was a street bitch. <laughs> <laughs> This was a street bitch. I love that. That's yeah. my favorite character. That Thank damn you. raccoon with the corn. God dang it. That's I was my living with my bitch way out in the suburbs. This wasn't my real bitch she took, but I'm sure she, it was a bitch that I didn't want her to take. <laughs> <laughs> that bitch said, Linda said, I can't fuck with you no more. Oh, I was, oh, damn it. Oh. <laughs> Linda's going to be playing. You want to see Linda? They don't play. <laughs> oh, anyway. oh, All shit. right. On a lighter note, if I can get one more out there. Uh, So during this time in sports news, uh, LeBron James, he's being sued by a photographer because LeBron uh, used the photographer's photo almost right after he, uh, the photographer, I guess, posted it or used it or he got hold of it. LeBron put it up on his Facebook. Um, so, so LeBron's the latest celebrity to come up against a copyright infringement lawsuit for posting a picture of himself. And since LeBron can't copyright the image of himself, he also can't sue people for taking pictures of him, at least not on copyright grounds. But they say that people who have taken those pictures are free to copyright them. And when the moment is right, um, the sub, they, they can sue illegal use of their um, own image. So this photographer, Stephen Mitchell, he states in the filing of his lawsuit, that's the photo. And that's actually his post. Uh, LeBron put it up on his Facebook. Um, All they got to do is take it down. You s- he, he has it. States in the filing of his lawsuit that he is a professional photographer and that he makes his living by licensing his work for money. So he's asking 150000 <laughs> in damages for this violation. So the photographer's lawsuit accuser... No, the, no, the, yeah. uh, LeBron says the Copyright Act of publicly displaying a copyrighted p- photography of the NBA basketball player without the photographer's authorization. So LeBron is accused of unlawfully conduct... Um, um, the court has asked LeBron to turn over the photo um, and any accounting, any accounting of any profits that were made off of his Facebook post. I don't, uh, I don't know. Uh, fuck y'all. So anyway, but now this is leaving people to comment and wonder, is this even fair for photographers who earn their living off of the fact that their subjects are famous and then turn around and then sue them? Right, because he ain't going to sue the average motherfucker that got the photo He's up. not going to take pictures of an average man, too. Bitch-ass so. nigga, yeah. motherfucker. You know what 150 do? 150K make you disappear, nigga. Mm. Yeah, real, yeah. Mm-hmm. real shit. Mm-hmm. Not even worry about it. They going to ban you. It ain't even ass. 150K. It's come up missing, nigga. You ain't going to take no more pictures. You going to be poof. Yeah. Pretty much. Nigga, mm-hmm. fuck that nigga. nigga they, they, I would give they, they sue for everything but, now. I was just going to say, yeah. if you got that paper, you can't even be around people, man. It's going to happen. That's right, right. If you got that paper, you can't even be around people, man, because motherfuckers going to say you did something to them. Well, hopefully they'll throw that out. about that photo credit shit, because I had a photo shoot and took my homegirl with me. She was a photographer, and when we was on the way there, I didn't even know she was a photographer. She was like, let me come with you. And on the way there, she was like, you know, I take pictures. Why you didn't use me? And I said, I didn't know. So while I was getting professional pictures taken, and I just brought her with me, we smoking and shit, this bitch was taking pictures of me. But the pictures she took look better than the pictures that I paid the bitch oh. for. So I posted one of the pictures she took. The bitch gone. Put on her thing. Oh, this janky bitch didn't credit me. I was like, bitch, oh. you need to. I'll beat your ass. I'm not from. Like, this is. That's you know, what you're supposed to tell She sent it to you. She gave it to you. But then it was crazy. She sent them to me. And I still looked out for her. Like, I gave her some money. Just a little cash. Like, oh, these pictures came out better. Oh, but the fact you didn't put her name or whatever. Yeah, I didn't put her name. But I gave her a little something for it. And it's only one picture I put up. And she went ballistic. And I was like, girl, you don't know who the fuck you're talking to. You you told her what you're supposed to tell her. I'll beat your ass. ass. (laughs) That fix everything. Like, that's crazy. Like, really? Like, but people. That's hood. Fix shit. Yeah. Crazy like Motherfuckers that. be signifying. Oh, nigga, go ahead on. Look at your shoes. Motherfucker, I'll beat your ass, though. <laughs> that <laughs> fix everything. His shoes. I'm talking about his shoes. Right. Yeah, but I'll beat your ass, nigga. Real yeah, shit. You told that bitch what you supposed to tell her, old funky bitch. All she had to do was say, yo, can you give me credit for and this I picture? And I would have did it. Mm-hmm. Oh, my God, but I would have did it. But she was jealous. I just forgot. Wasn't I that just... what we talking about earlier? Jealous. I know. Mm-hmm. That was some, That was a jealousy move. And I don't let... know how women hang around women. It's hard. That's why I don't know That's how why it's just always, you always have like a really short, tight pack of some. Yeah, yeah. it's true. Anyway, you might, um, you might get a, you might get you might get more than you might get two to three women that really fuck with you in your lifetime. Right. I'm talking about women who hang with women. Right. There's affiliates and then there's friends. You know what I'm saying? You say, oh, I know her. I hate when people throw that. I don't throw the friend word lightly. 
Like friend is rare. Say, some people say, oh, I, I didn't know you were friends with her. I was like, oh, no, no, I know her, but I'm not, we're right. not friends. I'm Let's make I'm sure with, that's I'm clear. A, right. And last, real quick, in case people have been getting bored, um, don't forget, um, you know, if you're sick of Netflix, Hulu, and all that, Prime Video, um, there are uh, live stream things that are happening. Like, for instance, Erica Badu, um, she announced last weekend, and she called, she's calling it Quarantine Concert Series, which will be live, actually. She just did it this past weekend for, from her bedroom. So she's doing performances from her bedroom. Like I was going to say, if you got her incense, you can really double up on all kind of stuff and light it up. I need uh, that. So she did a live um, concert her. series from her, her bedroom, and she's going to continue to do them. And she said, because we've been forced to cancel upcoming shows as a result of this pandemic, she also introduced a very cool alternative on Instagram um, saying that uh, peace and love, guys, the show must go on. The singer did perform her top songs from her bedroom, um, and she charged $1 to join the live stream. She said, we got to keep moving, y'all. We got to keep this thing going, and we're community of artists of survival depends on performing and creating, laughing, living, loving, and we still alive. But some real shit. yeah, she also was great about this. She took the time on Instagram to explain to some people the politics of being signed to a record label and why she's charging entry fee of a dollar. She said, we, re we rely on our life, sh our shows, and all of our live shows got canceled indefinitely. So we are not rich people. We just play, uh, we play rich people on TV. Some of us only have one form of income, and that's live shows. And um, she said, I wanted to create another revenue of income, and you're helping me do that in a big way because this is an experiment. Uh, there's nobody between me and that dollar. Also, her set list that she's going to perform will be handpicked by the logged-in fans. So it's not like oh. she's just – it's very personable. So, you know, she, she had did, a band in the bedroom. She did what she too, could. Also, my favorite one was my, my homie uh, DJ Nice, uh, DJ uh, D Nice, who held an epic, actually. That like, was uh, your homie. My yes. name is D Nice, name, and I'll be knocking out you suckers. I'm reading too fast. I went back and cleared it. I'm fucking it. with you, babe. Oh, that alcohol is getting to him. Okay. <laughs> anyway, he held an epic, um, an epic live party on his Instagram over the weekend, and he called it Club Quarantine. So if you want to know more about um, any of these, just Google any of the live stream, concert, party, nice stuff like that. He started the shit with all these motherfucking unknown DJs. Yeah, now they doing he it. He pressuring yeah. you to get on their stream. That's true, but there's too many. There's too many other big names, too. But he he, he was the first one to really do it. So. Nice. He did it these good. niggas tried to Very do it. Very good. He did, yeah. he did yeah. it real good. He said he doing what? It be niggas in the back of a Chipotle DJ and talking about. <laughs> talking about join me, join in, join in. Oh, I'm coming, motherfucker. Uh, <laughs> and not that people really care, but they did postpone the Olympics till next year. Mm. Well, we are trying to do a show here. Um, we said we was gonna do it on Friday, but I think we gonna we I think we gonna be able to do it. I'm not 100 percent sure. We will post it on, we, if we gonna do it, I'm gonna have a commercial on the 5150 network about the Friday show. I got a couple of guests lined up, but I'm trying to, I'm trying to get that home run guest. I want an R&B singer or something, so uh, all you R&B niggas that, uh, that, that, that feel like I'm cool, uh, <laughs> fuck with me, you know what I'm saying? You know I got a lot of respect for a lot of y'all. I see y'all out, we always speak and shit. Mm -hmm. I don't give a fuck. What the controversy is, I got love for you, whoever you are. Hmm. Hint, hint. <laughs> oh, some of these R&B niggas got controversy. That shit don't bother me. Let's come on this motherfucker laugh and talk about it. Mm -hmm. uh, but I'm a, I, matter of fact, I'm gonna do a show on Friday. It's just, I don't know what the guest gonna be, but I had a thing up for the 5150 Network to finally have a show besides the Tuesday show in light of everything being shut down across the nation. Cause I'm not working either and shit, you know what I'm saying? But all these bitches I fuck with went to school just for shit like this, goddammit, so they can take care of me. Fuck, I'm gonna go to college for Your daughter in school, your daughter was not raised well, therefore she will take chances and be around me. Your daughter's friend's gonna wanna your come take care of you. Your daughter's failure is my come up. Look, your daughter's friend's gonna wanna come take care of you, uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> We gonna get ready to take a motherfucking break so a motherfucker can pee. How professional is that? Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah, they got. <laughs> got him. Well, pee, we got pee. a cup over there, but uh. <laughs> He's stupid. We shall return. We gonna return fast, motherfuckers. Fifty-one fifty. They want you to stand up bad. And hey, you might want to double check this, Abraham.
back to the 5150 show, motherfucker. We are in the motherfucking house. Coming with that shit. It's live out our mouth. <laughs> <laughs> I put a bitch out of my car. She was in my car. That bitch said, <laughs> hey. <laughs> if, if somebody coughing, do that mean they got it for show? No. No, no. No, but, but if they say I it does start them. with a cough, though. It's like <laughs> cough first and then fever. <laughs> Ooh, that sound like it, yeah. <laughs> <You're stupid. laughs> That's crazy. As long as you don't start barking like an old dog. <laughs> Bitch be in the bed with you. <laughs> Trying to swallow the cough when you don't think she's sick. <laughs> hey, bitch, what you It's been going on five minutes now. <laughs> Boy, you ain't saying that when I <laughs> Oh my God. <laughs> All right, let me stop. Well, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> what we do here at 5150 is not just talk shit. We make beautiful music that is here to hit home. Hit it. Yeah. yeah. Got them funky bitches around you. What you think gonna happen? About a friend I know <laughs> who brought a hoe around her family and then she showed her ass. Friend fuck the dad took his money. Now I ain't got no change. A friend fucked the dad and took his money. Now I'ma beat the bitch brain. <laughs> a friend fucked the dad and took his money. Now I ain't got no change. Sat on her father's face. Now their family is damn this. Kill you, bitch. Check it. You broke them holes around your father's house. <laughs> yes, you did. Mistake. You broke them holes, and now your dad got doubts if you his daughter in the first place. Okay. You broke them holes around your dad, and now they in his pocketbook. Whenever you hanging with funky hoes, you better take a second look. Yeah, yeah. I'm a friend for the dad and took his money. Now I ain't got no change. I'm a friend for the dad and took his money. Now I'ma beat out the bitch brain. I'm a friend for the dad and took his money. Now I ain't got no change. Your friend sitting on your father's face. Now you can't come to the nigga place. Pop's Check. been alone ever since Ernestine died. He needs some pussy. And this young bitch know he got money and she being real pussy. And he hopped up inside and was like, damn, this bitch is mushy. I need more of that. I need some more of this rat. So I'ma spend this last dollar. Hit that bitch with a holler. Hopefully she gon' follow. Give a nigga a swallow. Cause Pops is in the house. Got my daughter friend in the in her mouth, and I don't know what to say, but I'm out, nigga. A friend fucked the dad and took his money. Now I ain't got no change. A friend fucked the dad and took his money. Now I'ma beat out the bitch brain. A friend fucked the dad and took his money. Uh, now I ain't got no change. She smuggling her dad with all that puss. Now she can get the fuck on and she must. Uh. Fuck that bitch, I'ma rob her house. I'ma flock that bitch, I'ma sock her in her mouth. Bitch taking my money, bitch you must be crazy. That's my daddy ho, not no nigga Fugazi. <laughs> I fuck you up bitch, that's my family. And when I catch you bitches on, anatomy, I don't know. <laughs> Said that shit that you always should Cause a friend fucked the dad and took his money Now I ain't got no change A friend fucked the dad and took all his money Now I ain't got no change A friend fucked the dad and took his money Now I'ma beat the bitch brain Fucked your dad in the house you grew up Now you gotta get the fuck up and duck Watch them hoes at your family house. You gotta look at them, they crazy. They are. Watch them hoes at your family house. Look at that bitch sneaking around. What the fuck is she doing? You 
Don't take watch them bitches them. over your daddy house. <laughs> <laughs> daddy. Daddy, she get loose. She saw it a little bit right there. We know she can sing that. But you fucked up and you broke that bitch. Friend <laughs> fucked your dad. Friend <laughs> fucked your dad. <laughs> Friend fucked your dad. 50 records in the motherfucking house. Man. All day long. For the 2020. <laughs> you stupid. <laughs> that was a good song. Yeah. <laughs> on the spot hot. I like that. On the spot hot. On the spot what? Ain't too many niggas on the spot hot, man. <laughs> on the spot hot. Yeah, That's what's n- up. Some niggas got to get away for a couple of days and then they come back hot. But we on the spot hot, man. Oh, don't yeah, hate. We on the spot hot. These motherfuckers don't, they don't want to give motherfucking credit for that motherfucking uh, 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 creativity yet. Because sometimes yeah. when you see motherfuckers doing shit, you be like, oh, it was yeah. good. But yeah. nah, motherfucker. We came up with that shit. On the spot hot. The when they start hot. telling you who you sound like, that's how you know the hating is real. I don't fuck who you think I sound like. Nigga, I sound who like they me. say you sound like? They, they say Craig Tipsy. They say, my, Sugar Free, who is dope to me. Sugar oh, Free, I Sugar fucking free. love Sugar yeah. Free. One of the greatest of all time. We don't get Sugar Free on the show, Here man. Come. God, you damn. Do, he'll do it too for probably some weed and a little, uh, you know what I'm saying? I fucking <laughs> love Sugar Free. One of the funniest niggas on the planet. Man, oh, this motherfucker is, is Bitch, wrong. if I tell you a flea could pull a tree, you better get a chain and hook his he little ass, ass up. up. That nigga hard, man. I'm telling you. What? Oh my God, he one of the greatest. <laughs> We're going we to figure that shit out one day. We're going to yeah, figure that yeah, shit yeah. out one day. You see, God damn it. See, so this is the weird shit. Like, after the show, man, sometimes we used to go to the restaurants and shit. Motherfucker, ain't nothing open. No. Do anybody know anything open late? Food no, trucks. we got to go home. Is the food truck? That yeah. motherfucker wasn't there last week, No, D. he was there last night. There, He's he's here. Yeah, he was here. He was here that night. motherfucker ain't there. He was here last night. Last week we went to that motherfucker. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I ain't fucking with no food trucks right now. I mean, no, you fuck with this food truck. That's your Let fire. me tell you something, <laughs> hey baby girl. They got this food truck it's over like here. It's like Benny Hanna's. This motherfucker make wheel. that oh, Benny okay. Hanna taste and rice. Mm-hmm. Oh, oh yeah. The shit fire. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I bet mm-hmm. you fuck with this shit. Yeah. <laughs> and the, and and the Annie's is still open too on the weekends. The food on the truck. Well, I, they'll I, I, all get week. your I just money. work on the weekends, but yeah. No takeout is still is still flourishing. It's still good. That's cool. I hope yeah. that motherfucking truck's still there. Last week that truck wasn't there. I was so motherfucking hurt. Oh, after on Tuesday? Hey, what? You went there? They, yeah, they, I don't think it's gonna be open. There's no, you way. have to do takeout, oh, yeah. yeah. That's okay. Yeah. That's okay. Takeout be live. As yeah. long as you got a jacket yeah. and you can stand outside yeah. and laugh at the little You can go in, you just gotta stay apart. You they let you in that, that distance. Ain't no yeah. six feet distance. Is it? I was at the uh goddamn P.O. box today. And uh, this lady, she went and got in front of this other lady. She said, I'm giving them six feet, bitch. <laughs> yeah, like, damn. Damn. He was like, the, like, get behind me, motherfucker. Yo, but I can God. tell the other lady didn't know. But that yep. lady snapped. Yeah, good. <laughs> Well, shit. Everybody in there was like, damn. I would have did that if the bitch started coughing or something, but it's just not regular. I don't know. But then when she got to talking to the dude at the counter, she was up on him. I know he wanted to be like, give me six feet, bitch. (laughs) <laughs> this is crazy. That's real. <laughs> Everybody, don't nobody get nobody six feet for real, God mm-hmm. Nah. Mm-hmm. Only, in, only in a place. Darlene, ain't no telling where she been. Craig, me? ain't no telling where she been. You ain't got to worry about me, shoot. You been places. You ain't got to. It don't matter where you been. It just matters you been there. Yeah, but how often do you go and where and with whom? I know the same places I go and come. That's it. Today, I was at this place that um, sell them RVs. Right. Are you really gonna buy RV? Man, I'm gonna get the fuck up out this of motherfucking girl, LA. Doomsday prepared. Right, you nigga. Serious? I'm gonna be up there in the woods somewhere. Same thing. He said all that too. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. If you see us, nigga, you sure. better pick us up. Some uh-huh. shit go down. Uh-huh. <laughs> nigga, if it go down, I'm gonna already be in the mountains. <laughs> I'm going to the mountains. I'm gonna get my. Oh, I, I, I was thinking about should I lease one or should I buy one, but they actually are affordable. You, you be mean, on there, they be trying to get rid of them motherfuckers. I think at this point, yeah, everything everybody... is about. Just about pretty much more affordable than it was, was like, before. What you want? Shit, what you got? What you got, nigga? What you got? <laughs> right, right, right. <laughs> yeah. yeah, I love RVs though. That's tight. That's it is. Cool. Yeah, that RV mm-hmm. shit though. I'm finna yeah. get the. They got the ones with the stove and all that yeah. shit. Yeah. Mm-hmm. It ain't no yeah. bullshit. The yeah. They open yeah, up. Yeah. That's, good. That's a good vibe. I feel like you might be fucking side bitches in there though. But yeah, I that too. <laughs> 
That it's too. just a kitchen in there. <laughs> Where you live, Corey? Uh, everywhere. I live in the mountains, bitch. <laughs> I live everywhere. Wherever this motherfucker is. Four bush well, yeah, here. I'm a celebrity, so we got yeah. KBC. Right. I'm going to run that game. That's right. She run game, too. <laughs> you done ran TV game TV. on bitches yeah. before. You ain't fooling me. <laughs> that's hilarious. You going to get a fifth wheel or you going to get one that's his own? Somebody say yeah. RV equals side chick hotel. The forty dollar well, mobile. Shoot, that's what they say about vans too, though. I mean, even a van, anything that's got some space in it. Mm-hmm. But let me tell you something, man. This RV I was looking at. If you take a motherfucker in that motherfucker, this ain't no regular shit. Yeah, no. Right. They, they, they got some dope yeah. RVs oh, that they trying yeah. to get off the lot. Hell right. yeah. What's been the you average? Might as well buy you a popping one and say you gotta go on tour with it and and, and put it in your business and yeah. I don't want the one to drive. I want the one you could just park it. Oh okay. Oh, oh you want the fifth yeah, wheel. I ain't gonna get a fifth wheel. I'm gonna get one you can pull regular. I don't. I, I, I don't want that shit all in my truck like that. I don't right. want that mountain shit like that. Right, but right. But they got big ones you can pull regular. Oh wow. Okay. Yep. Fuck yeah, yeah nigga. Get you one, man. I'm gonna be motherfucking fifty one fifty in the mountains and shit. Oh <laughs> shit! What the fuck was that? Big ass cougar. What the fuck? Is, what's, what's going on out there? I don't know. I heard some a woman. I heard a scream. It's all those tire guys, but that sounded like a woman, huh? Screaming. Well, you know, on that, okay, that wasn't my horn. I'm checking my shit. shit. Got them. We had, well, motherfucker, <laughs> I guess you cool. They didn't knock on the thing. We know the tire guy. Oh, okay. Yeah. yeah it's, it's, wait a minute, where you park at? Right behind all of y'all. Oh, you say, okay, we good. Yeah, we Everybody good. straight. That's what they probably talking about, that shit, right? Oh, maybe. I don't know. No, but it's not like a woman. That's a what, woman in here? That's what threw us off. You know? Actually, she screamed, didn't she? Yeah. yeah. See like if a bitch scream. getting raped out there, oh, y'all. Shush. Real oh, talk. I want to see it. I mean, stop it. I was going to say, we didn't check on a screaming bitch. That's fucked up. That's that why they say you're supposed to scream fire. Right. Yeah, right. Because then scared. you know what you know what supposed means. to do what? You're supposed like, to scream fire. When you're a woman, you're supposed no to scream what. fire. Because right. when you scream help, people be scared and don't want to help you. But when you scream fire, fire, they'll come to you. Right. It's See, you just gave bitches some real game right there. These bitches <laughs> yeah. don't know nothing about that. Yeah, that's fire! Yeah. Uh-huh, the rapists be like, you. this pussy fire, Nick. <laughs> 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 That'll probably be the rapers screaming at <laughs> <that laughs> you. Fire! Yeah. Yeah. He gave that to him. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> What'd you say, D? They gave you that one. They just served it right up on him. Oh, okay. Mm-hmm. Well, rem- well, first of all, I won't. The homegirl to plug her shit, and I want y'all to fuck with her. I'm telling you, I'm gonna have her on the road with me when she got time. She got business to handle right now, but I'm fucking with her. I can't what, what's your Instagram and all that shit? Um, my Instagram is Camara White is, and my Facebook is Camara White. And um, I have a podcast called The G Spot with me and Precious, and then we have another podcast coming out on All Dev called On These Hoes. On these hoes. <laughs> <laughs> I so love y'all it. keep it tuned, you know. I'm I'm trying to keep it moving and uh stay busy and you know stay working. That's what's up. Shit gonna start mm-hmm. cracking. Uh Craig, man, this motherfucker Craig is the sleeper. This motherfucker is the is the producer slash talent slash everything. Uh-huh. Craig be showing me shit for the show he put together. I'll be like, you did that? Yeah. Oh, that all star cast in that motherfucker too. Oh hell yeah. Damn, somebody out there beating. It be I, like that. Just let the thing got, down. It's okay, cause we finna wrap it up. <laughs> we wanna hit it. I wanna hit a. I wanna hit a Mexican music while Craig talk. Go ahead. Uh, hey. <laughs> nah, I got uh, my, po- my podcast every Thursday, yeah. Craig Facts, and then I'm doing my own podcast on All Def Digital, a roast me podcast. And then I got my sitcom that I produced, dropping Big Head Craig. So be on the lookout for that. And then I'm dropping a quarantine LP. You know what I'm talking about? <laughs> it's fire. You know what I'm saying? So uh, that'll be ready for y'all in two weeks. Support all my shit, man. When I be disappearing, niggas, because I'm working, man. I'm trying to eat out here, man. I don't give a fuck about nothing but eating right now. So support me, man. And, uh, yeah, that's what I got going on. That's what's up, mm-hmm. man. You know he working. That nigga up in here with that. A river runs through it as Jack. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, 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 this nigga got prototypes and shit, roast buttons, <laughs> and shit. Oh yeah, oh yeah, go buy the roast button too. Yeah, yeah. go Elk buy the roast Mountain, button. What was that? Huh? That's what's up. Brokeback Mountain jacket. <laughs> yeah. What movie? That's that's the movie. No. River Run Through. Jacket come over your hips in case you gotta pull your pants down in the cold. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs> that's funny. <laughs>
Hey, yeah. look, motherfuckers, I want y'all to fuck with us this week. Friday, we doing a show in this motherfucker. I don't know how we going to do it or how we going to put it together, but I'm going to try to put it together. No, I'm not going to try to put it together. I'm going to put it together this Friday, 8 o'clock. We going to do, I had a name for it. In here. <laughs> but, but I'm going to post it all. I'm going to post it all. Uh, tomorrow, I'm going to start running ads on the 5150 Network. So y'all can get ready for the 5150 show Friday at 8 o'clock. This is the first time we're doing a show besides the 5150 show. It's because, God damn it, I ain't got to go out of town. God damn it. I'm in L.A., in my RV, up in the <laughs> mountains. What's the name of that movie, 2012? That was the name of the movie. When Woody Harrelson was up there in the yeah, wheel. Yeah, the Remember yeah. first, you heard it from Charlie. <laughs> That's how I'm going out. I ain't going out with no regular shit. Fuck that shit. It's corona, motherfucker. They say it's all on the gas pumps, y'all. When you use them gas pumps, you yeah. better wash your hands. What I did, I went in the store since all the sanitizer is gone. I buy that alcohol that come in the little spray bottles. Mm-hmm. Man, I spray the fuck out my hands all day long when I'm motherfucking out in the street. God damn it, because I Good. know yeah. this yeah. shit mm-hmm. might even be airborne. You don't know. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's a reason why they losing all this money. What? Something they ain't telling us. If they telling you to stay in the house, God damn it, that means it. Because they ain't going to tell you what you need to know. If they knew an earthquake was going to hit this bitch, they'd be like, the, the best, the worst part is over. Shoot, you'd see everybody leave, like those that had like money and that knew about what it. What was they telling them motherfuckers on 9-11? Go back to work. Go up in the other building. <laughs> it's stupid right. motherfuckers like, okay. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Damn it. That, 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 no, that was the last sound of a lot of people at 9-11. Mm. You want to hear it again? No. Yeah! <laughs> Some people was going back in the building. They had their lunch. You know what they were saying. I don't even feel sorry I for the motherfuckers in there. Oh, yeah, there you go. Damn it. There you go. <laughs> Somebody said, wash your Twizzler. No, nah, when I die, the I twist? want my ass to stink. It's some freaky coroners out there, man. Oh, my God. Mm. Corners be like, hey, hey, bring him in here. That's Craig, ain't it? Uh, yeah. I'll wake big up, head Craig, me. I'm big head corner. Hey, oh, <laughs> Corey, you got some sick ass fans. This oh, you don't said, know? You don't know? He said, you come into Alabama, I'm in Beham. I'll suck your pussy and asshole dry. Fine, funny ass. Oh, oh. Uh, sir. They, hey. <laughs> God perverts damn, out here. Nigga. They talk oh to people God. they don't know like That's that. That's that 5150, I tell you. Mm-hmm. It's perverts out I here. I do not. Ah. <laughs> Suck my pussy in my ass? I don't know. <laughs> that's hard that's to turn that's around. Hard to turn. Huh? Oh, my God. I ain't got to talk to you, right? <laughs> right. Uh, Put oh that God. in the shit. I don't want to talk to you. I'm putting my ass out the window of the car, that's and you figure wild. it out. <laughs> <laughs> At least that's what I do. I'm just fucking with you. <laughs> Look, a dick thing. I told well, you don't want to see no, it. Oh, I told you already. I told oh you. Oh, my God. They are. I didn't mean. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm used but to does it have a face? Dick in laying it. on a pillow. Nick. No, but that that's probably not his. What type of nigga? It only counts if you can see his face. They coming through. That's right, baby. It only counts if you can see his face along with it, though. Hey, man, y'all, y'all know you go to jail for that shit, right? I know, yeah. Do you know you go to jail? For I ain't gonna turn you in. Keep them coming. Let me. <laughs> well, come on. Show me what you working with. She ain't gonna turn you in. That nigga laid his dick on a pillow and took I a picture I told you I'll get him off. You saw the dick on the pillow, Craig? Yeah. I mean, I feel like that. I didn't mean to disrespect Craig like that. There ain't nothing Craig to be ashamed like of, Craig. But I was just proving my it's point. It's just a mean dick. <laughs> this nigga laid it on a pillow. Though. What the fuck? I did the same I didn't mean to. Ago no, because you know, we couldn't get our hair done because of the rolling. They talking about that's my that's hat right. hair. So I had to put a hat on. My hair is toe up. <laughs> Look, I got a broken nail. I glued it on there. It ain't right. It's just, <laughs> you can't, it closed. All the shots Everything are closed. Everything closed. Yeah. Fall apart. I have noticed that that it's women on the uh, internet talking about all the nail shop clothes. And bitches are doing their own hair and don't laugh at them. That's not funny. <laughs> you seen that? You seen that movie, The Wolfman? These bitches is like the Wolfman when he came up. These bitches be trying to tell you when you be trying to take their socks off. I'm going to kill. All of you. I mean it. Like I the mean Wolfman. It. You ever seen that movie, The Wolfman? Nah, no, He be trying to tell him. He be like, kill me, kill me. I'm going to kill all of you. That's hilarious. That's what people are going to get. They be laughing. Head. They was like, ha, ha, ha. 
That motherfucker, they, they didn't believe he was the wolf man. He was like, he thinks his father bit him and he turns into a wolf. <laughs> Now I gotta watch this. The 80s. Exactly, he brings up these movies. No, nah, this watch movie, all this movie came out in the early 2000s. But yeah. no, nah, you ain't never seen The Wolf Man. Hell no. With Anthony Hopkins. Like, mm-hmm. Nah, that's and the yeah. El Toro, motherfucker. The Wolf Man, good. The no, I seen Teen Wolf though with Michael oh, J. Oh yeah, with Michael J. Fox. Michael J. Fox is still holds with Wolf Man was fucking them motherfuckers up. Them claws. He was like. Oh my God! The Wolf Man will fuck the Black Panther up. Oh, That's all I'm saying. It's been remade a few times. Oh, the oh. Wolf Man will fuck up. He'll give Thanos a run for his money. This shit say 1979. No, no. it ain't that one. That's it's a, the one a, with it was made a Hopkins and Benicio yeah. El Toro. It was made a couple oh, okay. of times. Okay, it's been a lot of Wolf Man. Yeah, yeah. 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 But mm-hmm. this one is funny to me. Mm-hmm. No, I gotta watch. He be tonight. fucking motherfuckers up. <laughs> 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 I love to see that movie when people be like. Ah! <laughs> Do you know if you scream good, you can get in movies too? A lot of people don't. They, they, Try out. Yeah, yeah. Or scream yeah. good. Or if you just have a good voice. Voice over. Mm-hmm. Sure. Yeah, that's mm-hmm. real. Everybody, st- you need to put your scary scream on the motherfucking. Uh, real, on your real. On the 5150 <laughs> thing oh, and oh, send it to oh, us. Oh, oh. Put, it on, put it on Facebook, your scary scream. I got to set it up. I, I got yeah. a good scream when I practice at home. Because mm-hmm. you got that old dog bark too. The old dog. Yeah. You but like I got that one. Hold on, uh, act like um, you're the judge and you say you are the father. You are the father. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> I can't, uh, hell no. That's, nah. <laughs> that's horror. <laughs> I can't do it, I was... mm-mm, mm-mm. <laughs> I'm, I tried, but I don't know if I got it in me. Oh, don't forget, we should have Say, a... say, huh? say hey, would you do me a favor, would you say, no, I shaved my pussy here. <laughs> <laughs> nah, I shaved my pussy hair. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> Stupid. <laughs> oh my god. That's funny. <laughs> See, everybody's now requesting the old dog bark. I know it's been a minute. He ain't done it. I know. I ain't got it. Can you Sarah? I don't there? think Sarah's even seen the old dog. I ain't dog got it. I'm trying. Really, no, I really oh, she's like not that. impersonally on the show. Ah. Oh. <laughs> My voice, do I ain't got one of them. Ah! There we go. No, that's your scare? That's my scare. You yeah. gotta really be scared. What'd you say? Right. Do you I scream? You get a girl voice when you scream? No, it's probably, oh, I don't know what it is. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably a scared ass scream. If I scream, yeah. You sound like Howie Bell when you scream. <laughs> <laughs> Don't forget to let them know that we have a sh- new shirt coming up, and we still have the socks. The socks. Can- right, we got a real, we got a new shirt. I'm gonna put it on the advertisement for the show on Friday. I got a new okay. shirt. And I want y'all to support the shirt, goddammit. it. Um, and we gonna we gonna get this shit jumping Friday. I don't know how we gonna do it, but I'm gonna pull it off because I'm that mm-hmm. kind of motherfucker. All right, so once again, uh, thank you for showing up, Yay. sister girl. Thank you. This was good. It. This was good. <laughs> Brother Craig Fax popped up on us this week. Hell yeah. <laughs> Definitely. <laughs> I'm glad to be here. <laughs> Craig stupid. I'm glad he was here too because I felt relaxed. I didn't know who you was going to have. And I'm I glad you felt relaxed. Yeah. You, and I can tell you got more. You still was <laughs> being shy. Uh-huh. Yes. God damn it. Yeah. You know uh, what would have happened if you'd have showed me that dick pic? Oh, oh my. my. Ah! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Craig, I didn't mean to disrespect you like hey, that. I, I was just, it was just to prove my point. Craig, like, you done seen a dick before? I seen my dick, nigga. But you seen dicks? You watch it. porn? Uh, nah, Did I only watch lesbian dicks, porn. Huh? Oh, stop! Y'all gonna it. say all he watches is lesbian? Watch Come on now. Porn. I, you I go watch. to jail if, if that girl don't request the dick uh, pic. I'm telling you. I have sent dick pics, but that ain't like my thing. You sent them, Corey? I sent them up real close. Yeah. Yeah, no, I got, I got gray hair. They be talking shit. Get your gray dickhead ass out of here. <laughs> hey, fuck you, bitch. You asked for it. You ain't just for men in down here? You no. Can't. No. But I, no, that shit will fuck I, your I, dick I, up. I, I don't send dick like, pics. You got that benign in yeah. my pussy. Yeah. Yeah. Bro, what's it, beignet? What's it called? When I do, Beijing. when I do die, I bust a sharpie open and oh rub it on my, my balls. Yeah, oh I, my I don't God. send dick pics. I send, I send dick videos. Dick video. Yeah, dick video. And it's actually of you? 
Yeah, it's dick. I do a whole circular uh, 360 around my dick so they can see all off? angles. No, I don't, I don't oh, jack off okay. on camera, but I will, you know, give, you know. Well, let stuff. us see, Craig. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Hell no, I love you. I ain't never gonna. <laughs> 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 oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. They know you're Corey. Do that screen. Uh, no, <laughs> Hilarious. That's some wild mm-hmm. shit, man. What do a new fag say when he be in the room with another nigga? <laughs> that sound like what he say when he first put it in. A new fag. Uh, a, a new fag. <laughs> nigga new to it. <laughs> niggas who been doing it be like, yeah. Uh-uh. Shit easy, nigga. Uh-uh. Yeah. Be like that nigga in Pulp Fiction. Woo! Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, remember remember Jed? Yes. Woo! Niggas like, was making that noise when they was fucking... Big rays. Woo! Hey, hey, what's that shit? Yeah. Only Friends. You no, ever that heard that? Pulp Fiction, Only Friends. Only Friends is a new site that kind of like YouTube where you could charge motherfuckers and, and people be fucking on it. Like, really? Hell yeah. Log in. Watch How you be knowing girl. about this shit? All the bad bitches got them. Only Fuck. Friends. Only Friends. Uh, I think I'm saying this it nigga wrong. This nigga put the nation up on that shit. They need to Only give me a check. Friend. Yeah. How we know you, you know about Sarah, Sarah? going to be on that motherfucker. Only fans, there yeah. we go. Oh, I Only fans. Somebody Only fans. sent me that. Oh, yeah, they do now that. I know what, what that means. Yeah. But I'm saying, that's cool. Like, if, if, if enough motherfuckers paid, I'll fuck a bitch on Only Friends and do a, a comedy show. You now. won't Only fuck fans. no bitch on Only Friends, nigga. You be, you be bullshitting, Craig. Craig, <laughs> Craig, no, he won't. Yeah. You know, he Craig. Be- probably, he probably pull his dick out of his pocket. Go You want to put on a show? You wouldn't beat off on camera for a thousand bitches if they paid you ten dollars. <laughs> <laughs> a thousand bitches paid you ten dollars. That's what only friends is. They pay a fee and watch you beat off. I'll beat off for a few thousand for some bitches. I don't give a fuck. You'll bitches do the pay to watch it. Yeah, you do why that not? Erica Badu from your room. You'll do the you know, you know the, the concert. In- inbox series. me, ladies, if you were paid no. to watch me jack off. Just inbox me. But see and- Craig bullshit. <laughs> No, but they got these big girl fetishes, and this dude, okay, he was at a show, and he was like, I could get paid for eating food, sexy and shit. Like, if I fuck a watermelon, like, if I eat a watermelon and let the seeds fall in my titties, mm-hmm. and be like, ah, yeah. they'll pay me. I'm like, well, how much, dude? Uh, they yeah. Uh-huh. <laughs> how much? I promise mm-hmm. you. They're making real money, not no bullshit money. They're making real money on there, man. Yeah, that you, you no longer have to be. Who a is they? Star. Just the, one, like, the people that do it. A lot of bad people bitches. Just issues. come out the bag, Craig, and tell us what you didn't did. You, I'm gonna show you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but I would like doing. to produce comedy sketches that have sex scenes, yeah. and it'd be real sex scenes, but it'd be on OnlyFans. You do like, who would you pay comedian wise to watch fuck? So I would pay, I would. I didn't like the Dolomite scene. You didn't like Did the Dolomite? Did you see Dolomite when, nah. the, when the roof caved in on him and the Dolomite, the new one? No, nah, I ain't seen oh. I ain't seen yeah. it. Well, I seen would. Uh, I want to see uh, Alex Thomas fuck Coco Brown. Ah. Uh, <laughs> okay. It might work I would, for him. I'm just saying, you know, she got that nose job too, so. Her nose job, her nose used to hook and come like this, but then she got the nose job. She got so work done and only got a nose job? <laughs> they, look, that was the only thing they would let her do. They say, <laughs> can't make we a back can't smaller. Do you would do your nose, man. <laughs> <laughs> we I can like do your nose. Way more shit done than that. No, no she can't. That they, she can't get that shit pulled back. They be like, oh. your skin ain't. You ain't a good candidate for shit, but a nose job. Mm. And I, now her nose oh, go no, up like a pig. Not, that's not a new one. I'm like, this bitch got a snout. Yeah, that's, 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 that's the, the old one. That's the old one. She's old, yeah. Mm-hmm. Find a new one. Get a get a latest picture. That motherfucker is like. Damn, getting old as fuck. That bitch is like Pumbaa in this bitch. Oh my god. <laughs> She's trying to eat me. <laughs> she just needs one. Of I these. love. Love. I'm not against plastic surgery. I would pay to see Cosby fuck Tiffany Haddish. That would. Yeah, that's good. a later. That's a newer picture. <laughs> Get that bitch that off bitch. the screen before she act like we did. She gonna do that LeBron shit. <laughs> bitch, we ain't, we ain't got no money for you, bitch. You can sue this motherfucker if you want to. You gonna find out like Aries did. Oh. Them lawyers gonna be like, they ain't got no money, bitch. The fuck you come bringing this shit but, to me? But that's why I use the one that he posted up. Because I'm like, no, LeBron, if they post something up on their own social media, it's for it, for all to take. Unless they have a watermark. Or unless right. they say not to. But if they post it up on their social media, which LeBron did. All you photographers, mm-hmm. fuck y'all. Y'all, yeah. y'all some bullshit motherfuckers. Mm-hmm. What you tell them? Beat I beat your ass. <laughs> <laughs> and you know me, bitch. 
you get out the yeah. car in front of your house and she right there, you're gonna, yeah! <laughs> 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 I'm fucking with y'all. Hey, y'all, 5150, we about this bitch. Friday, it's on, motherfucker. Spread the word. We're gonna start posting it on the 5150 channel. We up out this bitch. Yeah. Hey, hey. Your mama easy, nigga. This, 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 this,